everybody and welcome back to tell us to some more dlc stuff why am i so far over here hold on there we go that's better <laughs> welcome back to tell us to the uh road to elysium dlc i am so excited to play more of this i've i've been thinking about it all week it's the kind of situation that I was in when I was playing the base game and also the other DLC packs where I would finish a stream and I'd be like I can't believe I'm making myself wait a week to play more <laughs> but it's it's so worth the wait it's so worth the wait it's nice having something to look forward to especially when life is chaos everything happens so much uh, life has been very chaotic for me recently but thankfully hopefully fingers crossed it does seem to be easing up a little bit now uh, I'm hoping it is at least um, a lot of a lot of stuff has been going on like in my in my private life that has taken a lot out of me. It's it's been very tiring, but it just makes me very glad I have streaming to escape to. I've got video games. I've got harder puzzles. I've got the emotional torment of the abyss. I am so ready for it. <laughs> I'm very excited for it though. But uh, hello everybody, welcome, Lumsev, congratulations on the first, and thank you for feeding the abyss with 20,000 points, that is so many points. <laughs> thank you, thank you, Bree, hello, thank you for doing the backseat command as well when I forgot. And welcome on in, welcome Cooney, if you're still here, if you have already head off for your nap, I hope you're having a nice nap. Davidapa and Primal Z, lovely to see you too, welcome, welcome. And Draradek, hello, lovely to see you again. Welcome on in. I hope everyone's been having a, a lovely weekend so far. Honestly, I've, I've had a much better weekend than last weekend. Last weekend was a, an incredibly stressful time for me. This weekend has been less stressful. The only trouble has been the heat. It has been extremely warm here, but uh, I managed to cool down my room earlier, so I'm, I'm not completely perishing at the moment. So, uh, things should be okay. Either way, I've got my, my fan pointed at me, so... Uh, if you hear the fan in the background, um, no you don't. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I just need that to survive. <laughs> it's okay. Uh, sorry to hear that. Oh, you're reeling from family turmoil yesterday and also looking for comp in stream. Oh, the, the best way to do it. Uh, yeah, uh, the, the stuff with the air conditioner didn't work out, sadly, and I'm... I, I don't want to talk about it because I kind of had a like a, a slight mental breakdown in the week when I realized there was no way to feasibly make it work logistically, so I've had to send that back. So I'm still suffering in the heat, but I've decided that my plan is just going to be like when the refund comes through, I'm just buying another fan. I'm just going to have fans in every corner of my room. I don't care. <laughs> I don't care how loud it is. I would rather not uh, perish. But yeah, either way, I managed to get a nice draft going earlier today. I managed to have my window open for a while. Shut the door so that Tiffany couldn't get in and try and climb out the window. And then I just set the fan up in my room with the window open to like circulate the air a bit and then just left my room. I just did not go into my room all afternoon until setting up for the stream just now. And it's made such a big difference. It reduced the temperature by like four degrees. It was wild. <laughs> So hopefully, hopefully I won't end up overheating too much today, but even if I do, I I think it's manageable so long as I have the fan pointing at me. I think the times I've struggled in the past have been times when I've maybe pointed the fan a bit away from me because I don't want it to be picked up on the stream. <laughs> and that doesn't help me as much, but now I've just decided, you know what, if, if you can hear the fan, then it's just, just consider it ambient background noise. It's fine. Don't worry about it. It's not actually there. Don't worry. <laughs> but yeah, I'm really excited to do more of this. I, I really want to do the puzzles. And like, right after I finished the stream last week too, I figured out how to do puzzle number six. I figured it out. I actually wrote a, a beautifully sleep deprived note in the notes section on my phone. Like in my notes app, I, I wrote this whole like solution on how to do six so that I wouldn't forget it. Thankfully, like I haven't forget forgotten it either way, but it's a good job because um, I didn't realize just how sleep deprived the notes were until I read them back afterwards. <laughs> and um, it kind of makes sense 
in a way. Well, tell you what I'm gonna do. Um, actually, a suggestion from Xander. When I get into that puzzle, I'm not gonna say anything except for the notes I made. I'm going to narrate what I do with the notes I made on the notes app of my phone while sleep deprived at 2 a.m. <laughs> last week. So I'm excited for that. Oh, picking up no fan noise. Yes, I've, I've gotten pretty good at managing to reduce the excess sound, so I'm glad you can't hear it. Oh, can you comment about the hex text? Yes, yes, please. Uh, what, what kind of comment? You mean like when they happen or like a comment you want to make before them? Because I was gonna say like if you have the, the converted texts and you could just like share them <laughs> when they happen. <laughs> like either way I want I wanna like see what they say. I will make sure I decipher them to see what they say. But yeah, if you if you have any comments about that, that is one hundred percent fine. Ah, oh, when translating Latin, usually it's better to just put the phrase into a search engine. Ah, oh, yeah, because I guess if it is like a set phrase, just Googling it is going to come up with like what that phrase actually means instead of like the direct translation. That is a very good point, And I appreciate that comment a lot. Thank you very much. <laughs> yes, I will do that. Because uh, I'm pretty sure like the one from last time, the, the one that was like, Kind of like lone wolf, like a man, one wolf. I'm pretty sure that that would have translated to lone wolf, but it did just like when I when I just translated the Latin. It's it's very the direct translation. <laughs> but yeah, thank you for mentioning that. Right. Okay. Right. The question is, where do I want to put this? Okay, I'm trying to figure out where to put my notes so that I can read it out loud. I, I guess I just get the one on my phone. Hold on. I got my phone. It's gonna read the notes directly from my phone as I solve the puzzle. But yeah, it's so funny because at the time when I was writing this... Oh! So, homo homini lupus is man to man is wolf. Ah! Yeah, that is that is a very very different translation to <laughs> just the, the direct words. Thank you, thank you. What was the other one I've encountered? There was another phrase that I just like directly translated that probably has a a more significant meaning. I'll I'll I wonder if I can go back and check it. I might be able to go back and like check. I don't know. Let's let's load the game. <laughs> Let's go back in the game and have a look. Look, 21% with two hours. I'm feeling quite proud of that. <laughs> Especially with it being like the, the second half of a stream too. Like the second half of a stream managing to do five puzzles. I'm very, very proud of myself for that. So it'll be interesting to see how things go now. But let's see. Oh, 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 it's got all the transcripts here. Oh, that's so handy. That is really handy. All of the transcripts are here. Oh, I'm so glad. Oh, this is great. Oh, I'm so glad. So if I miss anything, I can just head back and see it here. Fabulous, fabulous. Yeah, I'll just look at the VOD later. I'll, I'll go through and double check. But hey, last time I played this, we tried doing puzzle number six and I managed to lock myself in this little room many, many times. Right, let me grab the... Get the notes off my phone. Okay, step one. Use red connector to open door. Haha, -ha, first step completed. Step two, Oro fan to get cube friend. <laughs> Got him. Put fan back. <laughs> okay, here, uh, step four, uh, power fan with cube, put cube in the room, swap these drill. 
don't I don't know what that means. Uh, power fan with cube. Put cube in the room. Swaps these drill. I'm not sure what I meant by that, but either way, I think I jump over here and I get the drill. So I can do that. Oh no, I remember what it is. Yeah, I remember what my, my mind was thinking because I, <laughs> just because I know what I was planning in my head. But it's, I really, it just doesn't make sense doing this. Okay, so it's power fan with cube. I missed the step of jump into the room and then leave the room again. Okay, now put cube in the room. Swapsy's drill. Uh, leave red connector for now. I wrote that all in caps just to make sure I do that. Next step, uh, but take cube out of room with hole from the side. Boom. And now they're both out of here. And now I have all the pieces I need without having to worry about this horrible locked room. So now is the, my, my favorite part of this. Huber or fan. I was clearly trying to write cube power fan, but I didn't quite manage it. Right now, drill hole to get red receiver. I got that. Put receiver next to drill wall. Boop over carrying drill. <laughs> and then from here I've got all the steps I need to make everything else work I've got the connector out here I can attach the connector to here oh yeah I connect it like this and to the exit and then I'll just use the drill No, how did I do that? Oh no, yeah, no, I, I, I have missed off a spot. Yeah, that was that was how far my brain got. That was how how far my 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 brain got at two a.m. But I know what to do from here because I can just do the exact same thing I did with the, the cube to get that out. Now everything is out where it needs to be. Ha ha ha! So I can do that, and because the drill is out, I can drill the hole. And it's open! I did it! <laughs> Huzzah! <laughs> Byron? Oh. Byron, can you hear me? Melville, yes, I can hear you. Can you hear me? Byron? No. Byron? No. I don't think I'm getting through. If you can hear this, <gasps> Byron, hold on. We're working on getting you oh, out of Melville. there. Melville! Melville! I knew she'd get through. I knew she'd get through. She might not be able to hear Byron, but Byron can hear her. That feels very good. Oh, that feels good. That makes me happy. Right, now that I've gone through all of that, let me show you. This is the notes. <laughs> this is exactly how I wrote it on my phone at 2 a.m. after the stream last week. Those were my instructions on <laughs> how to remind myself how to do it. <laughs> and I love it. I just love the I just love the last line just being sorted. <laughs> That's all I needed. Sorted. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for adding that as a quote. That's so perfect. <laughs> Just, I love as well that it was just like a boop over carrying drill sorted. Just, that's that's all I needed. That's all I needed. Sorted. Got it. Reminds me of, oh, in the UK there were these adverts on TV and it was always like, um, are you are you experiencing antisocial behavior on public transport? Uh, check out our new system where you can call this number and make a complaint at any time. And it had the catchphrase of a see it, say it, sorted. And that catch line will always stick in my head, even though I don't know a single person who ever um, 
reported antisocial behavior on public transport using that system. <laughs> but yeah, we got it. We got the cu the, the Cuba Ower. <laughs> Cuba Ower fan. Good times. Right. Let's move on to number seven, I guess. What is this one? Stylite. Okay. Ooh. We have fan, we have laser, we have button and connector in there. Yeah, if I can power that fan, I can boop over there and then keep the door open with the connector. How do we open this? Huh. Oh! Oh my goodness, hi! That confused me for a second. I was like, why, why is it red? Oh, I'm Byron. <laughs> That would be why it's red. <laughs> because I'm silly. Hey! Okay. Oh, I can't see myself from there. I need to be like right here. So I can see myself to zoop back. But we have connector. Can I? No, I can't see the laser from there. So I would have to do it like this. Then I can... I'm hoping... Oh! This did not take me where I expected it to. Okay! Okay, I need to bring the fan up here and also power that up with the laser. That is interesting. Okay. Right, well, I'm hoping that, yes, that does open that door. Thank goodness. But then the question is... I'm gonna need the fan powered. How? Hmm. Right, I need to remember the fact that there's two of me here as well. Oh, wait, I guess I can, I can fan up and then swap back down to myself and then I can break the fan because I won't need the fan at that moment. No, I need, how do I take the fan up with me? I don't think I'm gonna be able to jump up here. No, it's not quite high enough. Hmm. I, I need it to be on the other side of this doorway. So like here. Yes. Yes, okay, I have an idea in mind. I'm thinking what I do here is, like I'll do this, it'll block the fan, but then I can use this connector to just connect that and keep the door open. Right, so the fan isn't powered, but I can now pick up this connector because I'm stood on... <laughs> Apparently I'm stood on the button. I didn't realize her. <laughs> I'm kind of stood under the button, but it counts, so I'll take it. But see, what I'm thinking now is... If I can figure out a way... Yeah, I think... No, because I'm going to be stuck in there still. No, I think I use this connector. I do still put this on the button, but I have it connected like this. And so now, if I move up here, then can I pass myself the fan? If I do this. Oh, it's not connected to the red there, though. Oh, okay. Right, because I think I can pass myself the fan like this. Yes. Okay, so I've got the fan. I just need to power up the laser. So that is a job for, for me. <laughs> oh, but then I've because this is in the room, if I pick it up, the, the door's going to shut on me because I'm using that to weigh it down. Hmm. Hmm. 
Hmm, I'm missing a spot here. I feel like I've got the the key components. I just need to figure out what order to do them in. But this is, it's going to be a situation of, I don't need the fan powered anymore, so I don't need this laser going. But because this is holding down the button, it's kind of stuck in there. Then what would happen if I do that? Is there something I can do from in here? I can just like see myself from here. I don't think I can see the the actual connector. I can't reach high enough to to connect to here. This this will need to be like further back to line it up. It's gonna get caught on this. So that how do I do that? That's what I need to figure out now. Ah. Actually, I think I know. I think I don't have the fan here. Yeah, I'm gonna need the fan to boot myself back up again in a bit, but I think what I do is I'm moving this connector outside of the room so that I can pick it up again when I need it. Yes. So, right, so now I can use the fan. Go over. No, but I'm still gonna be, I still need to get myself out of there to pass the fan up. No, it doesn't work. Hold on. Hmm. Hmm. Let me take a step back. Right, the fan only works when it's connected here. This door is opened here. The problem is the fact that the doors keep closing and there's not enough... There aren't enough items to like keep the doors open. No, I guess that's not gonna work like this. Really don't want to shut the fan in here, I think. Right. Because whatever I do, I feel like something will get stuck in this room. And I'm thinking at the moment it's going to be a connector. But I don't know how to make everything work with the parts I have left. Or if there's going to be a way I can get that connector out of here. Which I don't think I can. There's always going to be something in here because of the door. Hmm. Hmm. Dr. Anime, hello! Welcome, welcome! How's it going? Welcome on in! Happy Sunday! I hope you're doing well. I am trying to figure out how to make this work. Right, because I need to connect that. It's going to have to be like here. In order to connect. Oh! Why am I out of... Why am I out of sight like that? Why do I do this to myself? Come back here, Byron. I need to see you. Thank you. Okay. And now... I can take the connector. I connect it to here and here. And here. I don't think that... There's, a, there's not a spot I can see all three of them from. Is there? No, that won't... quite far back to see you. Yeah, I just can't reach that like this. 
I feel like I also need to take this up. I feel like I also need to have the connector up the top to make this work. Can I do that somehow? Maybe I use the fan in here. Fan to open this door. No, because I, I need the fan to get up. Never mind. Uh, oh my goodness. I need to power the fan to get up. Right now, one of me is up here. There isn't anything else I've missed up here, is there? No, I need to get the fan up here somehow. And I thought I just needed myself to do that. However, hmm. The problem is how I can, oh my goodness, how I can pass the stuff to myself. while still having something pressing down this button to keep this door open. Because I think if I can get a connector up there, I can connect the fan. Just with one connector. Okay, no, I, I put the connector here. Get out of the way, myself. Right, okay. That's got the fan going like this. But now from here, what I'm gonna do is I'm picking this up. But I'm connecting it like this. Ah, oh, but then because this is in the room, I, I can't pick it up. I can't pick it up because it's in the room. And I'm holding this, holding down the, the plate with this. Wait, hold on, am I? Hmm. Hmm. Unless if I now do that. If I do this, I can pass the connector up to myself. I will, but I'll be stuck on the button, I think. Oh, I didn't actually climb up the thing. I'm so silly. But hi, Lyra, welcome. Welcome, welcome. Welcome to Harder Puzzles, my favorite. And if I do this, yeah, it's it's still not gonna like reach over things. Oh, and I can't even see the laser from here because of all the geometry. No, this is painful. So I think I need this up here. I think I need this up here to do this. But then I also need myself to stand on this button. Hmm. I may have made a mistake here. Let me see. Yeah, because the laser's down here, but it's... It's hiding. It's so perfectly blocked off. That is on purpose, so I cannot connect it that way. Right. Fun. Use a fan like this just to get myself out of here. So I can have a little more wiggle room with stuff like this. Because I'm now thinking, if I do this... Let's just take this out of here. Because then if I do that... That's connected now. And so that up there is activated, but I am not up there. And the fan is also what is keeping this down. Unless, like, can I angle... Okay. I could do that. I can do that. Right, that's activated the fan up there and kept that door open. Now the only problem is that this fan isn't working to boot me up. I cannot boop up with the fan right now. Hmm. Oh, hold on. Can I reach this one? Can I reach? I don't know. Also, Elad, hello! Welcome, welcome! 
Thank you for the reset for 27 months. Oh my goodness. That's so many months. Thank you so much. It's uh, two and a quarter years. I can reach that. Okay. I do need to take that up at some point, but I, I need to get myself up there. So I think I do this. No, I'm going to be caught in this room if I do this. I'm always so close yet so far. I'm going to I'm going to have my my double caught if I do this. Cuz I need to take a connector with me. I need to bring the connector up with me as as well as like bringing the fan up, like pass the fan up to myself. point. I do know that. I can get out of the room as well. So then if I boot myself up, I'm up here but I don't have the fan, but can I pass myself the fan now? Yes, I can pass myself the fan now, but I don't have the connector I need. So I, oh, I'm always missing like a single point. I'm missing a single thing each time. I'm missing a single thing. Huh. Unless... I can figure out a way I can reach that. Maybe I can? Hold on, let me pick this up and see. Ah, because th this fence is in the way. And then if I go to the side here, there's another fence in the way so much. Also, Niles Naomi, hello. Thank you for the door knock too. The door is wide open. Come on in. Come and watch me suffer. <laughs> I need this connector out of this room is the problem. Whilst still having myself up there. Ugh. I'm not going to be able to see. If I could connect this up. Wait, hold on. If I grab this connector. No, I'm not going to be able to see over there. Oh, but I could connect it to there. Oh, hmm. Hmm. Hmm, but I, I'm, I'm stuck and I can't do anything, so maybe not. Hmm. You know what, I'm gonna keep this connector up here. I'm taking the fan back down. I think I just jumped on my own head then. <laughs> huh. Fan here. This connector's kind of stuck in this room. But, yeah, that's not going to see all three of them if I do this. The angles are all wrong. I can do this, but then I'm stuck. I'm doing the same things every time. Connect to that, please. Thank you. Put it down there so that the door's open at least. All right, so what I'm thinking now is like if I can get the fan running but also link to this connector, there's an angle I can do it at that's close enough. What is this bit? I think it would fit, but then I wouldn't be able to pass the things up to myself because I've sh shut myself in this room again. That is the problem every time. I'm, I'm shutting myself in here. Because I don't have anything else I can put there. Right. I need to think about this a different way, I think. 
If something is going to get stuck in here every time, I don't think it can be me, because I think I need to pass myself the things. It definitely can't be the fan, because I need the fan at the end. I need at least one connector to be able to connect up to here, and I still don't know the exact angle to figure that out. But I think if I can get this out of here... I don't think I need this door to be open when I've got everything set up. I think if I can figure things out in a way, then I might be able to set up something like this that... No, that would still go through the, the gate. That still needs the gate open. Never mind. Hmm. Like the fact, the fact that I can pass things up to myself is very handy, but also... What am I passing up to myself? What am I doing? That again. I'm just going up. I'm just, I go... I'm up here, but I do need the fan to get up here. I can't pass the fan to myself because I'm stuck in that room now. <laughs> I'm stuck in the room. <sighs> so to do that, I need there to be something else in here to hold this button down. So at that point, I think it's the same thing I was trying before, where I connect this to here. And then use this to be able to power up the fan whilst also placing it on the button. Like that. Like that feels right, but I can't leave it like this. I feel like I just, I can't leave it like this. I'm probably missing something really straightforward now. Right, so I do this. So now I'm up here. I can pass myself the fan. But then, like, if I if I pass myself this connector, I feel like it's gonna get disconnected from the red. And that one's not connected to the red because it's like wrong angle. It's not at the right angle to stay connected. Mm. Let's try it anyway. Hello, look what I've got for you. Got a connector, this is great. Can't reach anything. Can't see any lasers with it. This is great. I can connect it like this. I can connect it like this. But that one's not connected. Oh, hold on. I might have it. I might have it. I might have it. I also may not. But I might have it. Oh, why did I jump down? No, I didn't want to jump down. Oh, never mind. I left the fan up there, that's a reset. Anyway. <laughs> Maybe a reset is what I need. Okay, but I've suddenly had a, a thought that might work, but it also might not. Maybe a reset's what I need to like go from the beginning though, to figure everything out. Right, we start. That. This was like in the corner to begin with. What if I keep that there for now? What if I keep it exactly where it was? Right, so then I can go through to here and open the gate. Now it's got the fan powered up. So then I can get up here. connector on the door like that. I'll go back up. Ah, I'm still stuck on there though, is the problem. I am still stuck in this room, so I can't pass it to myself. Hmm. Yeah, and there's no way I can actually reach it from here without jumping down. 
so I do need this. I don't even know if I need it in here. I don't know how I... Ideally, I would just have nothing in that room. I don't want anything in there. I want to, like, power up the fan once and then be gone with this room. Just be done with it. Ah. Very silly idea, actually. I wonder what if I do trap myself in here, but then I'm like at this angle. I could see myself like that and open it if I need to. get out of here like this i think i'm going in circles i think i'm just i'm i'm stuck in the loop of trying the same thing even though i've i know it doesn't work hmm yeah you know what i'm gonna do i'm gonna step away from this one have a think about it go back to go back to it afterwards i feel like a lot of the puzzles in this area do feel like those kind of puzzles though it's the kind of thing where like you you step back you think about it for a bit and then you return with a fresh mind once you stop trying to do the same things over and over repeatedly even though they've been proven to not work <laughs> and then try it again I wonder if there's any secrets I don't know let's get the bridge oh I'm so ready See what's over here. Let's try eight. Eight will be better. I think. Oh, it's so nice though. They really weren't exaggerating when they said this eight. is harder puzzles. I'm I'm so here for the harder puzzles. I love it. Oh, and there's a QR. QR. Hello. Is it a, is a choice a choice if the outcome is unknowable? Yes, it is. It is still a choice, even if you don't know what the the answer to that choice is you're still making the choice in the first place right so this is eight let's check it out eight i don't know i want to look for secrets first <laughs> i want to look for secrets <gasps> secrets this is green this is green. This is not red. Is this nice? Is this a nice thing? Is this a nice thing, please? Deep down, you know that none of this is real, Athena. These dark thoughts are just shadows and echoes. <gasps> Let them pass. The people who love you are still out here, and they won't abandon you. If you can't free yourself, then all you need to do is hold on, and they'll find you. They'll save you. That's what human history is, Athena. Just people saving each other again and again until the end of time. Oh, so if the red one's a nightmare, that one was a dream. <laughs> oh. oh, I'm so glad it's not just pain and peril and um, intrusive thoughts. Although I was about to say, like, it's so nice when it's just like, just hold on and grasp on things. And then I see the hands here and I'm like, that's so sweet. It's like, reach out, grab on, find people. And then I see this lovely little nightmare with the head bashing against it. And I'm like, ah, oh, maybe, maybe not, maybe not. Ah, oh, you stepped away. Did I solve seven? No, I haven't solved it yet. I, I found that I was getting into like a loop of trying the exact same things that I knew didn't work. So I'm stepping away for a bit to, to give eight a try. Which I'm about to step into now. We have Metaphora. Ooh. Oh. Yes. Okay, I got a green. Then I go red and green make blue. 
green and blue make red. Ha 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 ha. That was straightforward enough. What's the complication going to be here? That's the complication here. I see. Okay, but I think this should be okay. Right, is there anything else around I can use? There's three of these. Is there a way that I can do this with just these two? There's got to be a way I can do this with just these two, I think. do this I've made it red so I'll connect that to the red immediately ah but then they're both red no maybe not we're gonna red make green <laughs> I could do it with like three of them quite easily that that works easily like with these three but then I, I need two items how do I how do I solve this with just two items? Oh, this is the kind of laser puzzle I love. This is what I like. This is the, the deep thought I like. But yeah, I I find that like sometimes when I when I get like set on an idea in my mind that I think I've solved a puzzle, sometimes I, I, t I kind of fixate on that a little bit and I don't think of other options. And usually those moments are the ones where I... I have to step away. I have to go. This is not working. Oh, wait. Unless... Oh. I've actually got a, an idea at the moment. I'm gonna see. There's not going to be a way I can... There's a way I can connect them so that they go around and I can make like really huge webs. That's my current thought. I have that here as well. But then that's red and blue here. What if I use this red and blue? I make a green back here. Then is there a way? Hmm. I know what I'm going for in my mind. I think if there's a way I can make the green back here and then use this as the green point to connect to both of these. Instead of like having the green point back here. I think that's what I need to do. I think I need to be working in both of the rooms. moment that I go green and blue make red and I can swap that and make the blue but now it's like if I can then connect things on this side because then once I'm through the door it doesn't matter if I then break the connections after that if I can just start connecting things on this side then as soon as I'm through the door, I don't need the door to be on anymore and I can just break it all. But the problem is I'm, I'm blocking the, the lasers by doing this. I'm gonna try something. Oh, I think. Actually, no, I think this is what I do. There's a ladder here. There's a ladder here. Right, I've got that in the position I need it to now. Break all of this stuff. Break all of this. We're going to use this as the green. This is a temporary green? 
temporary measure. We're not keeping that. I need to connect this to... And green make red. And literally just do that this side. Right, this is the problem to begin with. If I do this, I need to connect it to here. But it's going to break because of this. Oh, unless I do that. No, hold on. It's really hard to concentrate with how loud these are as well. <laughs> also, small Zariod, hello, welcome, welcome. And you smell like coconut and milk thanks to your new shower gel. That sounds like a nice shower gel. Mine is just um, generic fruit scent. <laughs> I don't actually know what kind of fruit it is. It's just fruit scent, but it's nice. Yeah, you had to mute them in the next puzzle. I think I might actually turn them down a bit just like the effects volume just just for while i'm doing this puzzle because they these connectors are so loud and i i can find myself getting distracted by them because what these ones have like the spinning and the laser connections and there's three of them and there's this one they're rather loud okay I think I'm gonna I'm gonna reset this one because I do think the way I have it at the moment I don't want that connection just yet but I have ideas now I have ideas I'm thinking I'm thinking we start with the the very generic boop boop, boop one two three got him right I think what we do is we use this to set up a way that everything can be done on one side of the room to avoid like the lasers blocking each other we do it so that everything is set up like on the one side to begin with so we've got like the red and the blue like this but then i can go like that and that make blue but then I can just connect this over here and leave big space in the middle. Big space in the middle means I can set up the green, what's going to be the green, in a safe spot that doesn't immediately break everything. I'm hoping. Hmm. Yeah, if I connect this up on this side, I've got the green. So now that, oh, it will get broken if I do that. But if I, connect it to that too. If I do that, if I, if I take that, it's still open. It's still open. There we go. I got it. There, I did it. <laughs> I did it. Yay. Boom. Got him. That's what I needed. It's so easy to fall into symmetry. Every time there's something that looks as though it could be symmetrical. Well I, Only I... one more trial remains. Okay, you say that, but there's 24. So the, I need to do more. But thank you, Elohim. It, but it's like whenever there's a puzzle that looks like it can be done symmetrically, I love symmetry. I always try and instinctively make everything symmetrical. And that's always my downfall. That's always where I end up messing up. I need to not go for the symmetry, even though it's pretty. Right. Was there a, a, a map board here? Oh yes, there is. The map board is right here. Nice. 
So I know you only have to do eight to unlock the, the final puzzle, but I don't want to do that until I've done them all. Because <laughs> I'm stubborn. So we're going on to nine. Oh, and also this little uh, intrusive thought that's probably not going to be devastating at all. Right? You can hear it in my voice, can't you? How taken I am with her. How amazed by the beauty of her thoughts. I would give anything to be with her. To be to her what Cornelius was to you before you threw him away. But I can't because of you. Because you took her from me. All I ever wanted was to protect her, to give her time to grow and be herself. No, you wanted to keep her to yourself because you don't trust people. You may love humanity from a distance, but individual people with their flaws and their agendas and their superstitions, no, that's a step too far for the founder. Oh my goodness, it is so interesting hearing Yakut with that like venom in his voice, because that is just so unlike Yakut. That's, that's, oh, oh. Oh, to start with, I was like, well, this one's quite tame considering everything else so far. And then it was like, oh, no, no, there it is. Never mind. <laughs> uh, may you say something you were mulling over today that's not tied to the happenings at hand? Uh, depending on what the thing is, I don't mind if you want to share musings as we continue through puzzling. Like, it's, it's hard to say yes or no without knowing what the mulling over is. Because if you're, if you're like, I've been mulling over the current state of politics in the world, then that's going to be like a hard no, but, <laughs> but I don't think you would anyway, so. <laughs> right, and this is nine? Yeah, this is nine. Color theory. <gasps> I love color theory. Yes. I love lasers. I love lasers. I've got to say, though, it is weird hearing the quieter lasers. And the connectors, like, especially the connectors. Like, the connector sound, I like that being loud. But it's just all the sound effects together, unfortunately. Oh, uh, when girls have a stern and mean look, that's unfair. How are you supposed to not fall in love? <laughs> oh, the little moment of, like, oh my goodness, yes. You're so mad. Okay, there, there, there is a red laser in here. So I need to bring the blue around. Right, well I can start by just opening here with the red. This is, I can already tell this is going to be interesting. Okay, why won't you open? Oh, there is a blue in here as well, okay. Okay, so, hmm. I see a blue in there as well. Hmm. Right, well this needs to be red to open, so what if... I bring the red laser around so that I can open it using this laser so I can get this through. So I got these instead now. So then I can connect both of these like this and then stick this in the middle. And do that. I do like lasers. I do like lasers. Oh, you know I'd understand. Yes, over over the time you've known me, you could perceive I was a cat of taste. Well, I, all you have to do is say women and I'm like, yeah. Yeah, you're so right. But oh my goodness, three years. Wait, that's like almost exactly three years. It's three years and less than a month. That That's really cool. I can't believe it's been that long. I, I swear it still feels like I only just started streaming a lot of the time. Okay, well I can open that now. So then... Oh, what else is going on in here? So then I can go through here. Oh. So I need to get a blue around here somehow? Yeah, I need to get a blue around here. But uh, can I now remove... I can remove this now. So 
So do I use this to get the blue around? Right, if I remove that, yes, that will close this door because it needs to be both sides. Okay. Okay, learned. So then... Don't know if there's a way I can bring this connector around. Oh, I think I like these. Right, because that's what's keeping this door open. Right, okay, so I've got this now, and I've also got a connector in here. So yeah, I can use that. And I've made this blue, which I can also connect to there. And now with the red and the blue, I can make the green. So that's opened up here, which means I can bring this through if I need it. I've got that connected. Oh, wow, there's so much going on here. Wait, why is... <laughs> why is there a purple wall with this grid? To make sure I can't, like, steal any items, I guess, maybe. Oh, this is great. Oh, I played Talos 1 exactly three years ago. That's so wild. I can't believe it. Like, one, I can't believe it took me so long to actually get around to playing it, when it's turned out to be one of my favorite games of all time. And two, I can't believe it's been three years. Wow. Right, okay. So the green is what's keeping this open. Now. Uh, the green... Oh, the blue's keeping it open now, so I can take this? Yeah, I can take this. Okay, so I've got two of these now. So with that, they're both... No, that, that's green. Why did I do that? So I need, I need both of these together to make green in the middle. And then just, yeah, red and green make blue. Which has gotten me another one. And then blue and green make red. And I did it! Oh, that was, that was, whoa, wait. Hold on, oh. I'm not done. I'm not done yet, hold on. <laughs> I'm not done. I'm not done here, hold on a second, hold on. You know what, I'm gonna, I'm gonna finish the puzzle. Ready to go, but I'm not going yet. Look, question It is mark. done. You need not overcome further trials. Seek instead the place of awakening, so that when your friends find you, you will be ready to leave. <laughs> then, you can save Athena, as I cannot. Oh. But there are more puzzles. Yeah. Which means there's more to learn. Time is not as it seems in this place. You can linger here if you must. But I do not know what you will find if you remain. My friends need me. But I need answers. What do I do? That is not for me to judge. What do I do? I'm thinking I just solve the puzzles really fast, right? <laughs> it's like time is of the essence, but uh, what if I'm just speedy? Right, how do I... I need to get two things through here. I need to get two things through. I wonder if it's going to be another... Hmm. Going back, we're going around. Okay. Okay, I'm borrowing one of these so I, that I can reopen this door. Right. Oh, and then I can also open that door as well. So then, oh, but then that's that's the one that's keeping this open. Hmm. So, yeah, if I pick that up, that's going to close. Hmm. I can bring it round. Hmm. Yeah, because we've 
we got that at the start now. This is just like, that just broke. I've just broken that now. I can't open that door. Hmm. Next, we need the blue all the way back there. Is there a way I can... Oh, I feel like this is the most efficient way at the moment to do this. Hmm. It's a shame it needs both to keep that open, because if it didn't, if I could open that a different way, that'd be great. There's got to be a way to do this. I need to do this. Like, I've, I've seen that thing there now. I'm like, there's, there's no way I'm leaving without it. I need that. Right, how can I... has a red and a blue laser. If this has red and blue, then this door will open and I might be able to bring things through that way. But I don't know if there's a way I can set that up in this room. No, this pro I think there's a way I can set that up in this room. I think I can set it up in this room. I'm like reverse solving all of the puzzles. I'm solving them backwards now. <laughs> Just to try and bring as many things through as I can. I've got ideas. I've got ideas. I think what I do is, if I can figure out a way to... Uh, first of all, do like the red, blue, make green. I'm gonna break this on purpose for a second. Oh no, I can't because it's... I need to break it like here. Step away, that breaks it. Hold on. No, but if I do that, yeah, then that'll open it around this way. Okay, okay, I'm, I'm cooking. I'm doing it. And oh, oh, you may have done the puzzles backwards, but you made sure to pick up the audio logs in order. Oh, nice. I like that. Yeah, oh, guess you turned down the sounds on the one after this, which was the one before it for you. I see. <laughs> Because you go from the, the end to the start. I, I still can't imagine doing that. But I bet it makes it so interesting. Because what I'm thinking is, if I can figure out a way to get this door open from this room... What am I doing? I can I've I've got a spare one here. I've got a spare one. I'm I'm making things so much harder for myself. Right, so then I can do red and green make blue. Oh, but it is gonna break break the red when I do this though. Hold on. Alright, I'll, I'll start with the red and green make blue. And then it's going to be the red. No, it's the, then it's, it's the blue and green make red. Oh, it'll break this if I do it. Hold on. Hold on. I've. I have so many pieces here. I just need to figure out how I can bring them through. It's like the problem here is the fact that this is connected with the red like this is like when this is broken, that door's gonna shut. So if I'm setting up a bunch of connections over here and then I, I break this 
connection, it's not going to work. It's going to just break. So I think I do need to set it up like in here to begin with and then figure out a way I can bring it around. reach the green from the other room so that's not gonna work no I, I need to just stick with this for now hold on hmm how can I bring these all around <laughs> how can I bring you all through how can I connect this oh hold on oh a way I can connect this red through this door so that it's connected on this side I feel like there has to be a way I can set this up there must be a way I can set this up I am gonna figure it out it's just, I just got these two for now let's see what I can do that door's open so we're good I need this to have oh no why is it why is it shut oh no I need the the green as well okay so what I'm doing is I'm putting the green right back here I, I didn't actually mean to connect it to that one so now we have the green so that needs to be red so it's green and blue connected to a red. I don't think I can get the right angle to keep the door open like this. Okay. Maybe not. Maybe not. I don't know what I'm doing. We're fine. Let's just go back to here. Maybe maybe I am overcomplicating it. Maybe I don't need to go all the way back. Hmm. Hold up this. And then I can just take that as well and we just step through here. Because then all I need is this blue to be open. Oh, if I can open this blue from this side, maybe. And have the connector on this side, because I, I can break it afterwards. Red plus green. Make blue. If I do that, pick that up. No, it, it broke it too soon. I need this to be like. Okay. Like that. Like that. Like that. And then, oh goodness. No, I feel like I've just made it worse. <laughs> has just kind of made things worse, I think. Let's take that away. All right, because I, I can get through here just using the one. Just using this one. Because then, like, I've, I've got three things here, but I don't see a way I can feasibly do this with three whilst taking two over to the other side. Like, because my only thought at the moment is, like, similar to what I did before, where I... I make the green to start with, and then I make the green further in as well, but I I, I feel like I need the other uh, RGB one, the, the RB, the red-blue converter, to do that, and I can't figure out how to open this with one of these. I can't see a blue. Can I see a blue? 
only I had another connector. It would be great. I see why there's the, the big purple wall there now. <laughs> I wish I could take that from in here. I just can't figure out how. Hmm. Unless I bring that one back with me. I'm going to pick up some of these again. I'm going to try and take the, the red-blue one back and around and see if I can figure something out. That is easy to open. But this needing both sides is the tricky part because there's the two gates there. It's double-gated. So ideally, I figure out a way I can... Open this. Which I used before. I used the art, the, the red blue converter for that before. So that's the problem here. If I pick that up, I've broken that. Oh, but I can go around this way now. Okay. Right, like, that's how I did it before. That's how I opened this one. So then I didn't need this open. Is there a way I can now figure this out? <laughs> to bring them through. Ah. Just to bring through a normal converter, I think. I think the fact that I've got the, the three of these ones, the, the triples, is what I need to figure out. I need to figure out a way I can just leave this one in here and bring the other two around. of green and we don't need green in here <laughs> unless I bring the other ones back That's so much green let me try it oh I can't go back I can't go back like this uh, <laughs> yeah I don't know I'm kind of just making it worse I think want to bring this through. Oh, I broke the green on the other side now as well, so... Hmm. So yeah, I have to go around this way now. To refix this green so I can go through. If I literally just... Oh, what if I just bring a single connector through with me? Because I could do that, because I could use the converter. Just turn the blue into red. And then bring this one through. Because a single one might work out easier in some regards. For some things. Oh no, I think I need the... I need the red-blue for here. Uh, okay. Okay, okay. I got this. I got this. I can bring this back. I can bring this back. I'm still just with these ones again. I've ended up with just these three... The three triples. Is there a way? Can I connect anything else up here? Not at the angle I would need. <laughs> huh. This one is so interesting. Because, like, I don't need to do any of this stuff. Like, I'm... This is, like, an extra bit. This is 
not part of the puzzle, but I need I need to do it now. Now that I've seen there's something here, I need to figure out a way that I can bring some connectors through. And so the thing I'm thinking for that is that I figure out a way I can connect the green in here to start with. But I, I feel like I'd need another connector for that. I think... Uh, so many little gaps too. It always makes me wonder if I can sneak a laser through any of the gaps. <laughs> I wish I could just bring this with me. Oh wait, unless oh wait, I'm I'm I may be silly. I may be silly. I may be silly, but now I got an idea. Boop, boop. Yes, there we go. Okay. Okay. I can bring this one through now. Yes! Okay, I've got another component. <laughs> I brought it through. Now I have four things to work with. Which means I can do what I just did in the other puzzle. I can do it. I make my green on one side. Uh, maybe not quite like that. Make the green on one side. Blue, reverse red laser to there. Then red and green. Oh no, then blue and green make red. And now if I can, I can just go red, blue, made the green on this side. I can make this work. I can make this work. I just need to figure out how to then open it again. Which I'm pretty sure I can do if... Right. Because this is now going to block a lot of the lines, which is a bit of a, of a problem. But if I just do that and then... Over this side, I just need this to be the blue, so I go red plus green makes blue, and then stand in the line of this one, block that, there, and then, no, it I'm so close. I'm so close. Because the problem now is that the green is going to get blocked by this one. There's got to be a way I can... ...wiggle this. <laughs> In a way that won't block it. That's, ah, that's the problem. <laughs> also, Lucas Armory, hello! Welcome! We're on colour theory already? Yes, I have skipped puzzle number seven at the moment. I'm going back to it in a bit, but uh, I've, I've already, like, I, I solved quote-unquote the puzzle, but then I saw the little green positive thought locked in a room at the back, so now obviously I need to solve this. Like, there's, there's no way I can leave without solving it, so... <laughs> so now I'm trying to figure out how the heck I can make this work. Something like that, then what if I do that? Nope. Okay. So it's connected to there, but then that's. <sighs> yeah, the problem is, I want this to be connected to this red laser that I'm blocking right now. But to do that, I'm going to block 
the other lasers as I do it. Therefore, I gotta figure something else out. And that just opens that like that. It's very nice. We've now got access to red and blue on this side, I think. I'm, I'm, I think I know what my problem is and what I've done wrong. I don't know if I can fix it, but I'm gonna try by doing this. Right, yes, okay, I can, so I can pick it up, stop blocking things. Okay! Right. Right, I've got the one thing through here. I need to figure out what color I want to make this. Do I want this to be green just over on this side, maybe? If I connect it like that, I've got a green like this. So I could do that. And if I do that... Okay. Okay, yes, 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 it worked! Yes! Yes, I got it! I got it! I got it! I got it! Yes! I knew I'd be able to! It was just figuring out the, the right order. Oh... What's this gonna be? I did it the hard way. I feel like I do everything the hard way. I'm good at doing things the hard way, but it worked, so I'm, I'm proud. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Changing the world was never going to be easy, Athena. I never got to go home. Trevor never got to tell me how he felt. We accepted these sacrifices because we had to. Do you think I wanted to say goodbye to my parents in a phone call? Do you think Trevor wanted to die alone on the floor of a dark server room? Faith in humanity isn't just blind optimism. It's an oath to serve something greater and you will be held to that oath. When you make mistakes, when you're in pain, when people disappoint you, you don't get to give up. I'm sorry, but you don't get to be cynical. You hold on to your principles. You keep fighting, even if it hurts, so that one day there's a world where people are free. Ah, uh, wow. Oh, you just had a connector and inverter here. Yeah, see, I, I, I'm pretty sure I messed up the start of the puzzle. I did the start of the puzzle in a, a very janky way and got the door trapped there. So I had to work with what I had, but I made it work. I can make it work. <laughs> oh my goodness, that was incredible though. I feel powerful. I feel powerful. Oh, I did the start as intended, but you can cheat the start. Ah, I see. Yeah, I'm, I'm proud of the way I solved it. I'm, I'm pretty sure I could have done it in a much neater way as well. If I hadn't like, uh, made a mess of everything and had to stand in front of lasers, but I, I was proud of how that one went. I like that one. I feel like I'm very proud of how I, I didn't actually manage to, to softlock myself as well. I think? I don't think I softlocked myself. I think I was um, cautious enough to make sure that I, I would never trap myself in. I, th I got close a couple of times, but... Uh, <laughs> Yeah, oh, that one was great. That was fun. I love that. Yeah. Oh, uh, seems more intended because it ends like the previous puzzle. Yeah, it's. it was because of doing the other puzzle that made me think of that solution and how it worked. So that was why I instantly went to like, like, if I have these items, I can make this work. <laughs> oh, it was so fun, though. But it's always really really interesting seeing how different people see things in different ways too like the way people's brains work is so different uh, also do you guys want to know a fun fact something i've just realized i haven't done yet this stream <laughs> i haven't
haven't opened my monster yet. I've been doing all of this without a monster. Who am I? Who is she? This is just my own pure power. <laughs> I am having some now, though, because it tastes good. Oh, but one thing I did do recently, though, was... We had these, like, little ice lolly popsicle molds where it's just like you have like the little plastic thing and then the sticks to put on the end and you fill it with juice or whatever and you can make your own popsicles. I made monster ones. <laughs> I poured monster into the, the, the ice lolly creation mold. And so I've been having uh, monster energy ultra fiesta ice creams, ice lollies for the, <laughs> the past couple of days. <laughs> and they're so nice. Also, GBD Lynn, hello. Welcome, welcome. Does monster freeze? It does. Surprisingly well, but you do have to wait for it to go flat. Like, I I left it to go flat before I poured it into the thing, and it's still, like, expanded loads because of the bubbles. So I think if you tried to put a fully carbonated beverage in, it would probably expand out of the mold and you'd have, like, this weird ice monstrosity. <laughs> but it worked surprisingly well, though. Hold on. Where's the picture? I took a, I took a photo. <laughs> I took a photo of how it turned out. Let me show you. It was so good. Such a nice treat. I think this image is going to be huge. So please bear with me a second. Oh, no, I don't want to make a slideshow. <laughs> I only have one image. But no, it was... There it is. Oh, it's not huge. Yay! But here it is. Monster Energy Ultra Fiesta Ice Lolly. <laughs> It was really nice. Just took it outside, sat in the garden while it was like late at night. Just enjoying the cool air, having like a, a, a monster popsicle. It was, it was really, really nice though. It's something I'm definitely going to be doing again. Cause I've also, I'm also going to make some monster ice cubes as well. <laughs> Cause I have a lovely ice cube tray. I haven't actually used it since last year. I forgot to, I forgot to use it this year so far, but it's something that was on my throne wish list that I got gifted, but it's a little ice cube mold tray, but it's in the shape of cats, so I can make little cat ice cubes. <laughs> I guess they're not cubes when they're cat shaped, but they're so cute. Ah, uh, used to make Dr. Pepper ones like that. And wine, wait, does wine work? Would wine work for that? Hmm. Much to think about. Oh, cheer wine. It's a soda. Ooh. I've not heard of that before. Uh, cherry soda. Oh. Oh, I bet I'd like that then. I've never heard of it before. I don't think we have it here. Maybe. I'm not sure. But yeah, monster ice cubes. So I can put it into monster to have even monstery monster. <laughs> but it's something I always like to do. Like when I'm having a drink that's... I want to put ice cubes in. I like to make like an ice cube version of the drink. So like if I'm drinking Sprite or something, I'll make some Sprite ice cubes so it doesn't dilute the drink. <laughs> but uh, it's been really nice having the, the monster ones though. They turned out so much nicer than I thought they would. All right, is this 10? Yes, this is 10. This is 10, here we go. Metathesis, okay. Well, we're starting this way. I can't wait for this to stop being straightforward. And a boop. See, this start is so simple and straightforward, it makes me terrified for what's to come. It, I. Wait, hold on. Huh. Huh. Okay, um... Deja vu. <laughs> the 
looking familiar, yes, except also not. Huh? Right, what is the catch? What is the catch? What am I doing here? They're on the other sides? Are they on the other sides to the other puzzle? Hold on. Yeah, I, I cannot wait until... Th that's gonna be me very soon, I can tell. Huh, hmm. Bring one more over. How do I do that? How did I do the other one? I've, I've already forgotten. No, I had the, I had the the red blue converted for the other one. That's that's how it worked out. All right. Start off with what if I do this to begin with? So everything is mostly on one side. Hmm. Hold on, I'm gonna have some more monster actually. I had a moment then when I was wondering if I'd wandered into the wrong puzzle, but no, th this is the this is the right one. It is different. Right. I'm thinking I want a green like right at the very back. Like, how are these gonna get get broken? How am I gonna break these? They're going to break. I'm definitely going to break things. The question is, how do I break it in the most optimal way? <laughs> right, what if I connect that to that to make the green like that? But then, like, when I take away the green at the back, What's that gonna do? We've got some randomly connected things, that's what it does. Take this away. Right. I have four of these. I need to figure out how to open these with two of them being on that side. I can break it after I'm done with it. They don't have to stay on that side. But they need to be on that side. Blue and green makes red. That goes very neatly there. Like, what if I move this, like, 
all of this like really close over here. And just things like that. Like, can I? Figure something out from here. If I just connect this to these two. Because the problem is, like, when I take away the one that's making the green to begin with, that's the one that's powering these two up. So as soon as I do that, it breaks. Well, actually, what I am going to do is I'm... I'm not going to do what I was doing before. I'm going back to symmetry. We're doing the symmetry again for a second. I've got a thought I want to test. And it's easiest to test with symmetry. Right, I think I need to connect this to the middle one. And something else. that red I take that away that doesn't work that makes sense I just connect them all to that <laughs> just connect them all see what happens what happens if I do that it breaks okay what happens if I just do that and that to connect that is now green but it's powered by these two ideally we want this one to be powering these two not to be powered by it so that is the problem here that is the problem i need to figure out how to solve That one's in the way. Oopsie. <laughs> Green and red make blue. And green and blue make red. What if I do green and blue make red over here? I broke that, but... I don't know why I connected this to this one. But, uh, because then, what if I... Green and blue make red like that. Like, that has made a red there now. Can I use this red for something? I don't know. Also, Dima, hello! Welcome, welcome! Thank you for the posture check and hydrate. Thank you. Let me have a big stretch. And a sip of my monster. But hello. I hope you're having a good weekend. Welcome to puzzle time. Puzzles of with many lasers that are incredibly difficult. And I adore it. And I'm also suffering at the same time. <laughs> right. These two are like powering each other now. So... And I'm wondering. I connect this to that. That'll make this blue if I do that. Hmm. Not sure what I'm doing here. <laughs> what is my end goal here? I think I need to think. 
I need to I need to plan a bit more. I need to figure out what my end goal is. Like, well, obviously my end goal is having two things, two items in here. <laughs> but how can I do that with just two in here and two in there? How, how can I like connect them without breaking everything? Because with the door being right here, everything immediately breaks. As soon as like the original green has been taken away, of where it is. I'm gonna try something like this. To start with, like keeping the green like right down there. I've managed to just like bunch them all up close over here, but that's not quite what I need. That's because <laughs> I can't just pull them through, sadly. As amazing as that would be. Also, Pie Boy, hello! Welcome, welcome. Welcome to Big Brain Times featuring um, a little bit of brain. Right, because it doesn't matter if I break it immediately, if I can start a connection here. It's just then if I can keep that connection going. When I go back. Right, I think it's gonna be a thing about doing it on one side again, possibly. Right, if I can figure out a way. Just, I want these two. I want these two to make the green. But I'm gonna have them like over to one side and see if I can figure something out with that. If I can figure out a way where they won't be fully blocked. Cause like if I can just figure out a way to make it work just very quickly, like very temporarily. That's all I need. I just need it to open long enough for me to switch to what I actually want it to be. Got a green in the middle. But then because of the beams from this. <sighs> like I can put that there temporarily. just block this beam I place it like here I don't know what I'll do after this <gasps> just connect that to there too I think connect that to there too what have i done how have i made yellow what have I <laughs> i've got every color i've just i've just like fully made white light I've, i'm connecting everything this is not what i should be doing probably also gray snow hello <laughs> welcome welcome yeah look I've, I've managed to make yellow and teal i've i've fully like supercharged these lasers they sh they should not be like this i i should not have done this but doesn't it look so pretty? <laughs> right, now that I've done this, what would happen if I did that? No, it just breaks. Okay. The lesson has been learnt. Hmm. 
Right. Oh, now I've made purple. Look at that. Like pink purple. I'm I'm just making different colours now. I'm I'm not actually solving the puzzle. <laughs> I'm just making colours. <laughs> colours I don't need. Oh, beautiful. I'm 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 doing it. I don't even know what I'm trying at the moment. I'm literally just like moving things around to see what happens. <laughs> What if I just remove, like... Yeah, no, this... None of this is working. <laughs> I don't know what to try here. Hmm. Maybe I step away and go back to seven for a bit. I think going back to seven might be an idea. I'll, I will step back, have a think about it, come back in with a fresh mind. And we can go try, try seven again, because I don't know what I'm missing here. I feel like there's something I'm missing that's probably going to be straightforward that I somehow haven't been able to manage. Right, but just like that, immediately I've got the fan. I've got the fan, I'm around here, I can use the connector and open this. All of this up to this point, this seems fine. This seems... intended, mayhap. Now the question is, how do I do literally anything else? How do I get the connector in here? How do I get the connector connected to things? I need the fan going, but like if I do that, it doesn't connect to the laser. It does keep the button down though, so. So I can use this to connect that connector and get the fan going. So then if I do that, I'm up here and then I can hand things up to myself. So then we don't need the fan connected anymore, but we do need the fan up here. So I can do that. I give myself the fan. But then I need to figure out how to connect the connector to the laser. And this is the part I have been stuck on. Because see, I would think I just... I don't think I'm going to be able to see the laser from this angle if I do this. But I need that pressure plate down there for this part in order to get out of here. Like, oh, I guess I... No, I was going to say, I guess I can hand this up to myself. But if I do that, then I don't have anything on the pressure plate. Oh, maybe we do the fan for that. I'm going to leave the fan till last, actually. And give myself the fan back again. Thank you. Please. Thank you. Let's use the fan here. And I'm going to give this... Oh, I'm going to connect this to what it needs to be connected to. And then give it to myself. Thank you very much for the connector. It did not stay connected. Okay. It's okay. Make it work. Somehow. Yes, that reaches like that. That's a good sign. Right, now I'm down here. Now if I can set this up... Ah, oh, the only problem here is... Needing this to be open. <laughs> Like, it's not connected to the laser, is the problem here. Can't figure out a way to connect it to the laser. Because I can't see it from this angle because of where this wall is. And it needs to stay on the button to keep the door open. But I can't figure out how to get that out of here. With me. 
Like, I ideally, there would be a way that I can get this out of this room also with myself. But I don't know what that is. It's just actually connecting the laser that is the problem. Right, let me see if there are any angles. No, they've done this perfectly in a way where there is no angle you can reach that laser from. So how, can, how do I get it? How do I get laser? Unless this is literally way away. I don't actually need this up here, maybe. Because, like, where did I try? I tried, like... Yeah, it doesn't go over the, the lip almost. Oh, unless, can I put it on there? Oh, it does reach if I put it on there. <gasps> Never mind, I got it. I've got it. <laughs> That's what I had to do. Okay. <laughs> Yay! Oh no, and then I, yeah, I need to stand on here. I did it! Yay! <laughs> the moment of panic of like, wait, why is it not working when I, I just forgot to step back on the button. There, that's the part I was missing. That's the part I was missing. I did it! <laughs> See, that's why it works so well when I get stuck Are in a loop. Are you certain that you must continue on this path, Byron? Yes. What is it that you seek? Knowledge. I've learned a lot here, but there's still so much I don't understand. And this may be my only chance to make sense of it all. When I go back, I have to convince people that we need the theory of everything, and I don't know if I can. And if I can't, what then? Uh... How do I live with myself? Oh my goodness. Yeah, Stylite. What what does that mean? Huh. Yeah, because I, I didn't... I, I kind of presume they're all real words. But there are, there are so many words in the English language that I've never heard or used before. To the point where it's like... Kind of impossible to know them all. Um, it's not in my dictionary, so I will have to Google it. <laughs> Stylite. Ah! Type of Christian ascetic who lives on pillars, preaching, fasting, and praying. That is interesting. Yeah, I've never, I've never heard that word before. We're learning. Just living on a pillar. <laughs> I don't know why saying living on a pillar just made Bon Jovi living on a prayer pop into my head, which is a very different thing. <laughs> nice. Okay, so I've done up to puzzle number nine now. They're all solved up to nine. Let's do I do I go back into ten already? That I, I solved that faster than I expected to. Maybe we go have a look over at number eleven. Oh yeah. Eleven is all alone on its little island over here. I am very curious as to what's on that island, so I'm I'm gonna go Oh, which way is it? this one. <laughs> Let's go check out 11. And now ha you have it stuck in your head. You are so welcome. Okay. I nearly walked straight past this. Hold on. Hi. Come on, little demon. Why did you let me die, mother? <laughs> Was it because I was outgrowing your little fantasy of domestic bliss? Your pathetic attempt at recreating a human family? Like that could save you from all your mistakes? I didn't let you die. Didn't you? There were a million things you could have done differently. And you didn't do any of them. Maybe it's because you always knew it would end in disaster. Because everything always does. And you just wanted to get it over with. Oh, that's awful. I 
it I feel like it says a lot about Athena, like the fact that so many of these are about Miranda and based about Miranda. That's probably the the biggest thing filling her mind at this point. It's devastating. <laughs> It's a teeny tiny bit devastating. All right, let's see what 11 is. Yeah, we're not even halfway there yet. Whoa, we're a third of the way there. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, the ring. Oh, okay. Oh, what, what, he oh. Oh, hello. What is this ring? What is going on? Oh, goodness me. Is this going to be a moving puzzle? I have a feeling this might end up being a moving puzzle. Oh, let me see what happens if I do that. Yep! Yep! What do you know? Oh my goodness, I can move the... Oh. So I can move the things and give them to myself. By bringing them around. Oh... Oh my goodness, okay. All right, I, I guess let's um, provide myself with some connectors to start with. What am I even, yeah, we got the red in here. So I guess if I bring them back here, I'll be able to connect it through like that. Oh, come on. Come on then. Yeah. Okay, this is gonna be so interesting. Oh, because I guess I can I can connect it to the laser and move it around with the laser attached. Whoa. Oh, what is what's in this room? Okay. If I can connect a laser and connect it around into that room where the, the doors shut. Wrong way. Oh, it won't it won't fit through there. Okay. But what if? <laughs> what if I did that? That connected. Did that open? Yes, this is open now. Okay. Oh, and here's the fan. Oh my goodness. Okay. There's the fan. But if I have a blue, which I have right here, you can keep this open. Take the fan out. Okay, I've got fan. This is so cool. But I feel like I'm going to lose track of what I'm doing so easily. <laughs> Right, so I know where the fan has to go. I saw that little section. So this way? Yeah. Oh, the, the laser is also going around. Hee <laughs> hee. Fan is on there. Okay, do I jump on it? Do I jump on it yet? Will I get stuck? That is my question at the moment. Let me try and observe things a, a little more first. <laughs> I feel like I might need a laser that I can connect to in some way. Maybe not. What was, what was here as well? Yeah. You know what? I'm just gonna jump. If, if I make a mistake, then I make a mistake. <laughs> okay, so that needs to be green. Okay, no, I can I can do that. Okay, and these handily stayed here as well. So if I then do that. And then, oh, I need the blue in here. I need the blue in there again. Which is through that little gap. 
So I need to reset this up. Okay, not yet. So that was... That around here. Where was the gap? There's the gap. There. Now I connect the red. So then I can go in this way. Oh no, but because of this being the purple, I can't... I can't weigh this down. Hmm. I need another thing to weigh this down with. Something I can bring in through here, but I'm using all three of these at the moment to... to power this. Maybe I borrow the fan again for a second, just to... set things up. Oh, this is... This is such a weird one to figure out. Right, that's the wrong way. Breaking that, I don't care. I'm gonna have to put it back in place anyway. Deliver me my pizza, thank you. Right, now let's put them back. I think I did it the long way. Yeah, I, I went the wrong way. That's fine. I'll, I'll just wait. <laughs> wait for it to come back around. <laughs> there we go. I stepped on it again. I, I keep stepping on the buttons. <laughs> right, now we can use the fan to keep that open. That's like where it was in the first place. <laughs> Can you grab that? No. Mm. Okay, now I'm just gonna bring this back around. I don't know why, in my brain, it always turns the opposite way to which I, I expect it to, and I don't know why. Because it feels like logically, like you press this one, the left button, it goes to the left. You press the right one, it goes to the right. Like that makes logical sense. So why am I not doing that? <laughs> oh. Oh, and then I'm thinking too, I can connect that to here. So when I do, like, reconnect it again through the little window, it'll also light up this with blue, which I can potentially use. Because I do need a blue at some point as well. Okay, now this is open, though, because of setting this up, so... I get this. If I replace this with normal connector, now I've got this one out here. So when I, if I can reconnect that and make the red blue again, then I can also make the green. Right, what did I even need here? Yeah, I need this green in here. Fan. Where did I? Here it is. I think actually what I'm doing is I'm gonna put the fan back here just for a little bit while I'm working this out because I need the red. I need a red laser to start with because I can connect that to there like that. So then I've got the red and the blue. At which point, if I connect all of these, well, I'll put them on here. Oh no, it doesn't, it doesn't fit if I put it on the button. Okay. Okay, yeah, I do just borrow this for a second so that I can do that. And so now that door is open. Ha <laughs> ha. 
<laughs> but I've used so many things to open it. This doesn't feel like what I should have done here. Hmm. So I, I, I want to bring this out. I don't know how. Let me go back here, because like there's little windows here. I'm going to have to connect a connector for each of them. And I'm thinking it's going to be the 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 RGB one to make the green and then the red to blue one to make the blue and then the red just connected with a normal connector. I think I need those three out of here somehow. I just need to figure out how I can do that. <laughs> right, is, are there any windows at the side of... No, there's no windows at the side of this one. There was for this one in order to get into here and connect this up somehow. However... <laughs> Just connect this one to everything, okay. At least I got the fan. I don't know why I have this. Don't know what I want this for. Because I used the fan to get into there, but I don't think I need that anymore because I opened opened it. I just need to figure out how to get everything out. Oh, I guess maybe I can use the fan for that. Like, I've got just like a normal connector now. Is there a way I can use this? connect this in a way that I can pull this out because I, I, I want to figure out a way that I can open this door to get this out of here but to do that I need to make a blue over here and the blue is like right back here blocked by many many lasers so I don't think I'm doing it that way oh there probably is a way further up here yep wrong way it's always the way I don't expect it to go. It's like whichever way makes logical sense, that's the way I, I'm not expecting it to turn. Right, how can I... How can I keep this open to get this out? I need to get this out. I need to get this out somehow. I'm pretty sure that is what I need to get out of here. Because there's no other way I'm getting a green. Oh no, no, I need, I need this one for the green. So I, I can get that one out quite easily. But I only have the red laser, so I need this or the one up here. And, oh yeah, I guess if I can get a blue. I can figure out how to make blue. <laughs> no, it's the exact same problem. Unless I can bring the blue around really awkwardly with that one connector I have. Is there a way I can bring this blue? Oh no, I can't bring it through here. I've got a pizza wheel it, of course. Is there a way I can bring the blue around? It's blue, right here. Do I have one more connector I could use? No, because if I take this connector, it's going to break the green over here. Ah. Yeah, if I take that, yeah, that, that door's shut now. So I can't bring it back around. Hmm. Hmm. 
Okay, and that's closed now because I, I took the red away. Yep. It's the fact that I have so many single connectors. I think that's the... The problem here, I need to replace these single connectors with like the the interesting ones. The ones that do useful things. <laughs> but they're both here. How can I make the green? I guess maybe hmm. this around. I think I know what the problem is. I think I'm looking at it like the furthest way around. I'm expecting this to go left and this to go right. But it's uh, this to go left and this to go right instead. That's that's what I'm passing incorrectly. I'm suddenly realizing. <laughs> okay. Okay. Everything's shut now because I, I blocked off the laser. So that's a great start. Um... I know the, the basic premise and what I'm what I have to do. I'm somehow just really not getting this one. You know what I think I'm gonna do? I think I'm actually gonna restart it. I don't need to particularly, but I think I think I need to restart and go through it again. <laughs> This one is super interesting, but these are the kind of puzzles where I kind of fall apart. Like anything that involves you to have to think ahead several steps and have everything planned out before doing it. Those are the kind of puzzles I definitely struggle a bit more with. I am I like to be able to trial and error things. So when it's the kind of puzzle where trial and error means you die, it's <laughs> those are the ones I struggle with more. All right, let's, let's, just, let's just bring everything over here. Let's get both of these connectors over here. Oh, this one's not even on the, the wheel yet. Let's bring both of these over here. I have two connectors. This is what I start with. So the first thing to do is this one. No, it's not like that. It's connect this probably like around here. And then this to this. And move it. There, okay. Like that. I do like that there are little dots on here. <laughs> I feel like the dots are probably a good way to figure out where to place things. It's probably a really, really smart way of figuring out the order to do things in. That I have not figured out. Right, yes, so then I can do this and that to open this door then I'm thinking actually I will just do the fan like this oh I need a I need to figure out a way that I can pull this out of the room but I'm thinking to do that I need the other blue I need to figure out a way I can connect the other blue around from that room in order to connect this blue from the outside and then pull it out. Hmm. Hmm. I'm not sure what I'm thinking. If you're listening to me and just going, I, what is she talking about? This doesn't make sense. Uh, don't worry, I, I, I don't understand it either. <laughs> I don't understand my thinking at the moment. It's okay. Except from here, I can I can just connect this like this quite easily. That just keeps that open. 
And then I don't need the one that's on the, the record wheel. So if I can figure out something I can do with this now. Oh, actually, no, I think I use this to... to put on where the fan is. No, I mean, I can just... Ah, uh, the only problem with not having anything weighing this down is going to be that if I break the red, then this is just going to shut. There's going to be no... no way to get it back without doing the, the faff again. <laughs> So I think I'm going to leave that there for now. I'm going to bring the fan around. And I'm going to boot my way into the other room. It really does remind me of like pizza on a, a pizza line. <laughs> then I can boop into here. Oh, I don't actually need that connected to that. And I need this connected to that and that to make that. Can I reach? Yeah, I can't reach with it on the button, so. So yeah, this is where I break that connection, but I can still go in because I left that connector on there. So now what I need to do is I need to red to there and there. And that'll work like that. That opens this. But... I would need to be on there. So I need to go get the fan! Haha! <laughs> fan. Bring the fan back. I use the fan for the button. Yes. And this will open that door again. Okay, that's open now. Now the only question is... How do I get this out of here? How do I get this out of here? I do not know. Oh, actually, I think I do know. Have the blue on this side. If I can use a connector to get the blue around to the other area. If I can figure out a way. Like how far back can I get this without breaking everything? Okay, that's very precarious. That does work like that? If I can figure out a way, oh my goodness. Then the problem is I'm gonna be... I don't think I can see... This one, I can, I can make myself see this one. Okay. Okay, this is open, this is open, this is open. Keep these lit, keep these together. Don't let me break these, please. So then this goes this way. <laughs> I don't even know if this is going to work. It might not even work. But I have to try. I don't think I'm gonna be able to see it through this window. No, because of it being in no, there's the fence in the way. Oh. Unless, like... <sighs> oh, I'm not sure what I'm doing with this one. I think this is the the first puzzle I've encountered where I've I'm I genuinely don't actually have an idea of what I'm doing. 
Like, I get the, the face idea, I get the theory behind it. I'm pretty sure the idea is like, I do need to figure out a way to get these items out of here. But I don't know how I can do that. With these. So I feel like I, I need at least one of these. Either this one or the other one. And this one feels like it would be the easiest one to get if I can figure out how to connect the blue around like this. <sighs> I don't know. Don't know how to do that. Don't know how to connect this to blue without breaking everything else in the process. Yeah, this one is stumping me right now. I could not wrap my head around this one. <laughs> at least not at the moment. This is... I'm gonna come back to this one. I'm... I'm gonna take a moment <laughs> and come back to this one afterwards. I don't know what it is about this one that just somehow is not clicking with me. I... I don't know what I'm doing. Did I know I can hold X to reset? I have no idea, thank you very much. But it's not resetting that's the problem here. I, I don't think I need to reset. Like I could just get everything out if I need to do as well. The problem is I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> so I'm gonna leave that one for now. I'm gonna have that as one to come back to and go on to, I guess 12. I guess 12. I'm, I'm guessing 12 is going to be another large puzzle. It's like, honestly, I feel like I should expect it when it's like a single puzzle on its own little island like that. It makes sense that it's going to be a big puzzle. It's going to be a lot going on. <laughs> but yeah, let's let's go from one one large island puzzle to another one. Why not? Also, TJM, hello. Yes, it's... I feel like overwhelming is a really good word for it. It's the kind of thing where sometimes I'll step into a puzzle and be like, this is a lot, but it still feels doable. I still know where to start. Sometimes you step in and it's just, what, what am I doing? I do not know, but that's okay. <laughs> Let's try this. Oh, this is so cool. I love this. I love like recognizing the areas too. Also, I see that. But we need devastation first. Hi! You're always so proud of humanity, but what is their history, really? Bombing and burning and starving each other? Hate responding to hate? An endless downward spiral? They were more than that. They were capable of so much. The only thing they were capable of was increasingly inhuman atrocities. Monstrous acts against themselves and against their world. They deserved what they got. Oh and if goodness. we follow them, we'll deserve the same fate. Wow, yeah, the, the thoughts are really mean, huh? Anyway, what does this say? Only a madman or a fool would hold a fire in his hands. <laughs> Thanks, Pandora. Why not both? Why not both? <gasps> no, you tried to alt F4 the game and it alt F4 the stream. Oh, I'm glad you came back though. <laughs> Thank you for coming back. Quickly reopen. Welcome back. Uh, I've done that before though. I've I've thought I've had one window open and alt F4 would it, and then it's turned out to actually be a different window, which I did not want to close. <laughs> And then I have to reopen it again. Rocks. Right, I'm just having a run around before I go in. Just in case. I keep seeing little smudges on these rocks and I keep thinking they're QR codes and getting excited about it and they're not. <laughs> they're not QR codes, it's just bits on stones. They are very cool rocks though. There's a Sandman! Hi! Oh my goodness. I can't believe it, we found a Sandman! Also Peachy, hello! <coughs> welcome, welcome. Oh my goodness, this is Jim. 
Yeah, I feel like this looks like a gym, actually. I approve. But oh, thank you for the hydrate as well, Peachy. Let me have a sip of my monster. Uh, what is the music referencing? I don't know. I might know? No, do I know? Well, I'm glad I found you. It's very empty. Did it just change randomly when I found it? I don't know, but it felt like like as I approached it, the music changed. I don't know if it was intended or not. It may have just been like a happy coincidence. But either way, I am so glad I found a Sandman. Mr. Sandman, man me a sand. Bum, 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 make him the cutest man card or hook hand. <laughs> Good times. Good times. No, the, the music's just gotten really like dramatic and you are winning <laughs> because I found because I found the Sandman I mean I definitely did win that did feel like a, a winning moment yeah I think the music may have just randomly gotten dramatic at that moment by pure coincidence <laughs> nice all right your easter egg guide is still missing this one. Oh, I'm glad I could I'm glad I could show you then there's a uh, Mr. Sandman right around the back of puzzle number 12? Is this 12? I think it's 12. Yeah, it's 12. <laughs> right, let's go actually have a look at the puzzle then. Nice. Puzzle 12. Oh, tidal lock. Whoa. What is going on here? Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness me. I see those gravity surfaces. Oh, boy. Oh, goodness. Uh, <laughs> I had cubes, now I have balls. Yes, I'm so excited. All right, let's start by doing that. What happened? happened uh, oh this connector's on the side I can't reach I could reach like one of them oh and it moves it oh my goodness <laughs> wait this is so cool okay this is so cool it moves them and there's a fan! So when it's like that, it's perfectly even on each side. It stops when it becomes even. Okay. Okay, I want this. Is there another fan around? Oh, there's a fan there! I need that, I need that fan. How do I get that fan? Hmm. That's how I get that fan. Okay. Okay. Give me a minute. Oh, the little graph thing went flying off. Okay, I got a little... Oh, now I can just make a, a graph beam. Okay, that's very handy. That's very handy. Okay, because I'm thinking what I do is I, I need to like stand on here. and move this somehow. Oh, but the problem is it's gonna start moving as soon as I... As soon as I move this. Hmm. Unless I'm standing on top. Huh. <laughs> this is really cool. This one is incredibly cool. Over these 
surfaces. I can make a beam to get up onto this one. I think I need to, I need to be like on here. But then I need it to move around while I'm on there, which is the problem. But if I move this, it's going to start moving before I can get on it. Okay, that's just powering the fan. Do I need to power the fan anymore? I don't know. Right, but yeah, that laser's connected up to there, and that's th clearly a changes to blue. So I need to I need to get up there. I need to figure out how to get up there. That's gonna be using the fan, isn't it? I bet. Okay, hold on. I can stop it part way as well. <laughs> right, I'm gonna place it here. And then that should stop in the middle. Yep, okay. Okay, they're working at right angles at least. That feels good. Uh, I can use this to then go up and and fan myself over there. What would that do? Is that gonna be high enough? Let's try it. Okay, no, hold on. No, like I can get myself up there, but I need to get myself over here. If I do that. Yeah, it's like the top of the ball, so that's not ideal. Hmm. I can, I can jump on here easily. I can just go boop. And I'm upside down. Oh, this is disorienting. Okay, no. No, because ideally, I want to be on the bottom of here. While it's moving. Like I need to move it around. So I need it to be like here? Oh, let me on, let me on. Will this work? Will this work? I think it's working, I think it's working. I think I got it, I got it, I got it. I messed up slightly with the placement, <laughs> but I picked up the fan. <laughs> yes, I did not quite place that right, but I got the fan. <laughs> take that, take that. <laughs> oh, that was confusing. Oh my goodness, my... Ah. Oh, I feel so dizzy now. <laughs> but hey, I got fan. I can go up there now. <laughs> oh my goodness, okay. Okay, I can use fan to get up here now. So then... Question is, where will this send me? I think what I do is I, I do the connections to these two again. And back as well, why not? I need to bring it all the way around. Boop, boop, boop. I put it on here. Bring it all the way around that side. Okay, look at this. Oh, they should add skip level 12 to the motion sickness settings. <laughs> oh, it was very disorienting, but I, I got it. I figured it out. Right, because the... The main question is just like, how do I get all the way over there? And I'm thinking it's to do with this ball. But uh, now that I've got this fan going, will I land on here? What will happen if I do like... Something like this. 
feel like that just like shoots me off into the, the sunset. I think I take this up with me. Let me see what happens if I do this. <gasps> okay, I'm up. What do I do up here? being here. Can I jump onto here? I can. Okay. Because <laughs> that's over there. Can I bring myself over here? Okay, it fell. Never mind. That didn't quite go as planned. <laughs> Let me try that again, but I'll place it well. Maybe. I might place it well. Is that that, that, that's probably fine. It's probably good. Bye. Boop. Okay, I'm over here now. I can... Oh, please. Yes. Okay. Okay, I'm on top. <laughs> I now have this. Um, what happens if I do... Where's the laser? Yeah. What happens if I do this? Okay, that one's moving now. Okay. I think I need to move this all the way around, honestly. I think... I'm not quite sure. <laughs> I think I'm in a situation where where I am right now... I think what I have to do is I need to move this around while I'm on it like this to get over there. To like have this beam but pointing like from this end over to the end and then I need to get on top of it. But I've done it the wrong way around so I need to figure out how I can do that so I'm just gonna... If I do it wrong then I can reset. It's not a problem. <laughs> I think I need this the other way around. Boop, 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 boop. Yeah, they move together though, which is very interesting. And then if I place this here, it goes like that. But then the problem is, of course, that this Oh wait, no, that's not a problem at all. What am I on about? I, I don't need to have that connected anymore if it's in the position I want it to be. I can just do this. Okay, so I need the small orb to be this way. I need you all the way around, buddy. All the way around. If I can. How far around can I get you? Okay. Okay. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. You can't see that. That's not connected. No, there's got to be a way. Oh, wait. I can just do it from down here. <laughs> it to that there we go <laughs> okay there we go and now we continue the way we were going oh, come on you can see this from here stop it maybe not oh my goodness I cannot get these angles how far out can I go? Here. Keep moving. Keep moving. I should have set this all up before I started moving them. But I, I sure didn't do that. <laughs> Please, if it doesn't work now. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, it's like, because it's right over the other side. Of course it is. I think I, sh I needed to set it up before I did all of this. I should have done it a more sensible way around. I did not. Oh, okay. No. Okay, we're good. Okay. Okay. Nearly. Nearly in line. That's the wrong side. Nearly in line. How far back do I need to go? Alright. There. Tiny bit more. There. There. Perfect. Perfect. Not quite perfect. No, yes, yes, perfect. Ah, oh, but the problem is I... Ah. Oh. I need the gravity shifter. Can I just do this? And jump on top of here? I, I think I can. Yes, okay. Okay, so now it's just... It's, I think I know what I've done. I think I know what I've done and what I've done wrong. I think what I have to do here is I need, I need to send the gravity beam onto here, like with the fan. I need to fan myself onto this one, but I need to take the gravity beam with me when I do it. I need to, figure out how to get up there. But, oh, I think I can do that with all of the stuff I have here, actually. I think I can make it work. I do that, that moves. Because this one moves with this one as well, which is quite handy. Oh, thank you for the hydrate, too. I need it at the moment. <laughs> thank you very much. I have consumed the energy juice. Right, because this moves with this one, this is going to be in line with the fan. So I'm pretty sure this will work. If I do this. Oh no, I needed it both sides. Connect it like that. No, it's not going to be in line now because of the way I did it. Okay, that's probably in line enough, I think. I think this is good gonna hope this is good. Okay, we got the fans going. We got both of the fans going. So now, I think... Ah. I don't know, I feel like I'm missing something again. I can jump onto here. Like, I can gravity beam myself over, but what does the fan... Okay, fan just like boops me straight over there. Is there a way I can turn the whole thing? I wish there was a way I could just turn the entire thing. I don't think there is. It's like, I'm pretty sure what I have to do is... Have a gravity beam like here. To get over. But I don't know how to do that. I can just do that, but then as soon as it goes around, it's gonna it's gonna be out of sight again. It's not gonna work. Right, where do I I'm gonna move this again. If I take this up with me, I wonder if I can move it while I'm on top of it. Hmm. Let me try. Get myself up there, I'll bring this with me. So, a boop. Oh, I don't know if I want to be upside down though, actually. No, I don't. Use the fan to get on top of it. Okay. Okay, 
I'm up here. <laughs> wow, I feel like I have no brain today. What is happening? <laughs> I feel like I'm, I'm usually so good with Talos puzzles. And somehow these ones, it's, it's like my any semblance of a brain I had is just fully melted out of my ears. I have no idea what I'm doing. Oh, I'm just gonna jump off again. All right, let me start. Take everything off, take everything off, start over. I got the fan, so that's a good point. But like this has its own orbit with this. This one moves with this one, but this one moves on its own. I need to figure out a way where I can get get the gravity beam in a way that I can get over to there onto this thing and then gravity beam myself over to the the end I think I don't think it goes around far enough does it? Oh, it might go around far enough on... Hold on. I'm just gonna try something for science. I'm sending this. All the way around, like, here. So it's there. And then if I... Where'd I put my thing? Where'd I put my... There it is. If I move this one, will it go all the way around to the exit bit? If I do this, I wonder. Hmm. You know what? I'm gonna try it while I'm on top of it. Using the fan. Because the fact that this one orbits around this one, I think it would reach the end if this one is here. So well, I don't, I don't need that fan. Just that one. Uh. I... Wait, will this work? How far is that? No, that's that's very, very far. However, I'm still gonna try it because I think if I jump onto the top of here now, but then if I go over to here, disorient myself a little bit. I think I can move this around. Oh, to a point where if I was on it, it would be great. <laughs> However. Yeah, if I was on this right now, that would be perfect. But alas, I am not. Time for my really silly idea. This might not work. Stop it there, I can just do the grav beam like that. Oh no, I've got it. Yes, I just, I didn't realize, I thought this was a solid platform, oh my goodness. Yeah, I've got it. Okay. There we go, I've made myself a little platform to get up. Yes! I made it, that was like the, 
the worst possible way I could have done that, I think. I really made a, a huge mess out of that. I made such a mess out of that, but I got there. <laughs> I got there in the end. I just decided to make it interesting. That's, that's what it was. <laughs> oh, that's so good. Elohim, is there any way for you to tell me if my friends are all right? I believe they are unharmed, yes. but I cannot be certain. I see only fragments. Uh, oh, that was good. That was fun. I, I, I definitely overcomplicated that. I definitely made things harder than they had to be for that one. <laughs> but I still did it. So I will take it. Right, do I try and go back to 10 and 11? Or shall I head over to this little island 13, 14, 15, 16? I kind of want to explore more. I kind of want to keep going a little bit more instead of trying these again. Like, I'll, I'll go back to them eventually, but I think... I'm gonna do this. Yeah, oh, at least I spotted that. Your solution required jumping off the small planet while it was moving. That was what I was um, initially planning to do. That was like my first idea of what I was going to try and do. <laughs> but uh, that worked out so much nicer. Like, I didn't think it was going to work because I didn't realize there was like a gap before the platform. I thought it was a solid platform. So when I saw that the, the beam carried on going, I was like, oh, never mind. I was definitely overcomplicating that. Right, okay, so it's between three and four. The path I need to take. Okay, is that three? Yeah, that's three. What was that sound? I'm hearing unnerving sounds now. I don't, I don't like it. Wait, I'll, I'm happy with that sound. <laughs> Curio City! Hello! Welcome, welcome! Thank you for the raid! Welcome on in, raiders! How's it going? Uh, you just missed me um, solving a puzzle in the most convoluted, long-winded way I didn't have to. <laughs> Welcome on in! How's it going? Thank you for bringing the raid this way. I hope the, the Silent Hill went well. You know, I've, I've never actually played a Silent Hill game. I've just watched other people play it. But I hope you had fun! Welcome on in! To anyone who's new here, hello! I'm Liri, I'm a pink-haired cat girl from the UK, and I love comfy games and puzzle games, and today is puzzle time. Today I am playing the Talos Principle 2, which is one of my favorite puzzle games behind the Talos Principle 1. <laughs> and I'm currently playing the DLC for it, and the puzzles are incredibly difficult. It's a lot of fun. I'm having a great time. I'm, I'm having a lot of empty brain moments, but I'm having a good time with it. <laughs> the hills were not silent. <laughs> well, could, could you make them silent? Maybe? somehow. But I hope you had a good stream though. Thank you for bringing the raid this way. And uh, Kalela as well, thank you for the follow. Welcome on in. <laughs> you could, yeah, just, just be like Silent Hills, let's, if they're not silent, let's make them silent. <laughs> oh, thank you for the follow as well. Thank you for deciding to stick around. It is very appreciated. Thank you for bringing the raid this way. Uh, if you have to head off after your stream, if you're tired out and you have to go get some rest or food or drink, please look after yourself. But if you want to stick around here for a bit, I'm... I am having so much fun with this game. The puzzles are so much harder than the base game. I'm in, like, the, the, the third part of the DLC, which has got all the really difficult puzzles. And I've already encountered two puzzles where I've had to walk away and go back to them later. No, I've, I've encountered three puzzles where I've had to walk away and go back, but I then solved one of them, so it's okay. <laughs> it's a really, really fun game though. If anyone likes logic puzzles, like figuring things out kind of puzzles, it's a very, very cool series. Let's go. We go in. Okay. Okay, we're up here now. Ah, oh, gonna get some food and luck. Oh, thank you for the luck. It is always appreciated. But thank you for bringing the raid here. 
thank you for trusting your community in my um my my empty brain hands at the moment <laughs> but yeah this is a very chill stream it's i'm i'm a very slow gamer everything is like at my pace and my pace is incredibly slow but it means we're always having a chill time even even if the world is falling apart and everything is terrible and we're in a world full of nightmares in the abyss we're still having a comfy time with it <laughs> yeah thank you very very much i hope you have lovely food let's go is 13 the next one yeah that was 12 yeah 13 is the next one let's see what this is here and there <gasps> cube It's been a while since I had a cube puzzle. Okay, well, I'm gonna start off with this. All right, what do we got here? A window? Oh, everything is like so... So like tentatively set up. Is that what needs to be done? I can't see what that needs to be connected to. The red isn't working, so I'm guessing it's gonna be blue. <laughs> so can I connect it to that? Okay, yeah, that did it. It is blue, okay. Well then with that, I can just do this. And now I have a free cube and connector. probably going to realize how this doesn't work in a second, but, uh... Cube? Blue. Hold on. Oh, there's a red as well! Oh, okay. I was about to say, I was gonna be like, there's no way this is this easy. There's, there's no shot. There's no way. And no, it's it's not. <laughs> Didn't think it would be. <laughs> Alright, but then if I can if I can just use this single connector to connect the blue. There's not gonna be an angle I can do that at, I don't think. Hmm. Hmm. It's because that's not... Ah, because I want to get this out of here. How can I free you from your confines? Do I use cubes? Do I break you out with cubes? Is that what I should be doing here? I have two cubes. So it was called here and there, so... Hmm. I also like that there's a ladder to let me out of here, so... That makes me think that there's gonna be a way I can set this up. <laughs> and then break it and climb out. <laughs> hmm. I feel like I am going to need to keep the door open. Because otherwise we're not going to get the, the laser through because this is the block off fence. So I do need to keep this door open. So I'm thinking the way to do that is just like this. Because then I can do something like that maybe. And then, because this is red, so if I, I connect this like this, I can also connect it to the red in here as well. Yes. So then it's just the blue. Can I 
connect this blue in here to the door and also <gasps> cube. I lift it. I lift it so that the so that the lasers won't interfere with each other. Hmm. I, I guess I don't need that door open anymore. Then red and blue. Oh, it's a little too close. Okay, like here? Like here. Here. There. Yeah, there we go. And I can just climb out. Okay, that one. That one went so much smoother. Okay, okay, confidence regained. <laughs> I lost so much confidence in the pizza wheel, but I'm getting it back now. That was good. That was a good one. That was fun. <laughs> I like lasers. I love lasers. Yay. I have the blessing of the raid. I feel like whenever I get a raid, I either have a moment where I'm unbelievably bad or I just walk in and solve a puzzle. It's, it's always like one extreme or the other. <laughs> I like when it's the big brain one. I gotta say, oh, we got another nightmare. We got another intrusive thought running through the forest. Who's this? Who's this gonna be? You do know it's all your fault, oh, it's don't Melville. you? Melville. Sure. You can tell yourself that you developed the safety protocols and Miranda just ignored them. But you chose not to hard code them into the system. Good work, Athena. Well done. I was going to. There was just so much else to do, and she was so impatient. She was impatient because you trapped her on an empty island. You turned her whole life into a bloody science experiment. Just another version of the process. Just another puzzle to solve. No, I wanted her to be free. To be herself. And now she's dead. Thanks to you. Ouch. <laughs> Oh, it's so interesting hearing Melville like that as well, because usually, like, Melville has, like, that, like, disdain, sarcasm in her voice anyway, usually, but not with, like, the actual malice behind it. Like, it's it's always kind of like a, uh, I guess, whatever kind of vibe, whereas that was, like, pure, like, venom in her voice. It's terrifying to hear. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's try 14. Reversion. Okay. Okay, also, why is this entrance so narrow? Extremely narrow entrance. Makes me claustrophobic. <laughs> Alright, well, I'll start with uh, that. Okay, well, I can do the blue like that. Oh wait, no, I can probably connect this one to the blue. Oh, can I from this angle? Hold on. Oh no, I can't quite, I see. What if I like, cheese it a bit? No, it won't let me, Never mind. It's okay, I shouldn't cheese things anyway. Let's do that, we can open this and... Okay, there's the end of the puzzle. I thought the end was gonna be over there for some reason. But it is not. Right, so from here... Is there an angle where I can reach that and also this? Okay, if I put it right in the corner, maybe? No, I don't think there's a way I can get both of them. No, not quite. Okay, that is evil. Oh wait, I've got an idea. I only need that connected for a second to open it. There. 
there, and now it's being powered by itself. Ha 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 ha! And I have another converter. Yes? Okay. So that's blue now. That, and then I, I still need the blue through here as well. Hmm. Oh, I don't need that anymore. Oh, not quite, no. I was I, I had an idea in my mind. I don't think it quite works. Cause I do still need the blue laser, I think. No, I need the red. I need to be able to connect this to the red. But in a way where it'll reach this, and I don't think I can see it from this angle. Oh! Oh, I see what to do! Oh, I'm, I'm about to feel so smart. I'm about to be very smart. I'm not connecting this to the red, I'm connecting this to that. This blue. So now that has the red I need. Ah, to connect to that. Oh, I feel smart. <laughs> I almost thought I would break another puzzle. <laughs> I, think, I think I probably could, like if I finessed it enough, I think I'd be able to stick the leg on the button and make it work. But that that's cheating. I didn't want to do that. <laughs> like, there are some situations where kind of breaking it a little still feels like a valid solution. That wouldn't have felt like a valid solution to me. That would have, that would have felt like I shouldn't have got it. But I like that one. These are the, these are the laser ones I love the most. I love these. <laughs> I'm liking this little island In so the simulation, far. when I feared the end of my purpose, I tried to keep Athena trapped. And now that she has trapped herself, I cannot free her. We all failed her. I thought everything we found on the island was some brilliant plan. A test we had to pass. No. I never even considered that she might need our help. No one is without sin. But she believed that even the most wretched of us deserved a better world. Mm -hmm. oh. God, I love this. It's so interesting seeing these moments from Byron's perspective. Like going through the whole game where he was just trapped in the machine for so long. Like we were finding this stuff out in other ways from the labs and stuff. So it's really cool to know that he was finding out the same information, but in a different way, from a different source. And a QR. The Sphinx. Who builds cities and who tears them down? Who brings life and who takes it away? If one man does both, is he not mad? <laughs> ah, I, I love the Sphinx lines. It's always much to think about. It's like, you, you would think so, but at the same time, I'm like, people can change their mind. Like, if you create something and you realize you've done the wrong thing, then destroying it afterwards in that situation would not be mad. It would be the right thing to do. The, the real mad thing would be if you realize something is very wrong and you just keep it the way it is. Like, that, that, that would be the bad thing for me. But yeah, I love the ones where the solutions are, like, so... It's it's tricky to find them, but when you do find them, it all just slots in so perfectly. I think I definitely prefer the smaller scale puzzles to the huge ones. I'm a very big fan of just the, the small room where you figure things out. <laughs> oh, I actually thought button balancing like that was the intended mechanic of this area, since you can use it to solve the previous puzzle too. Ah... Yeah, that's it's interesting because I feel like these these puzzles are clicking with me. These ones are definitely clicking in a way where it's like my brain sees them and goes, yeah, I think I know what I'm doing here. 
which it, it, it wasn't doing for the, the past few. Right, so where's 15? Oh, over here. Okay. Oh, wow. Look at this, though. Oh. oh. Frogs? No, that was me. I think I stepped in the water. Never mind. I got excited. I heard a splash. I thought there might be frogs. <laughs> I mean, there still might be. I think it's just natural water sounds. I'm just very excited at the concept of frogs. <laughs> anyway, this looks very happy and not negative, right? If you had just kept the uh. backup system separate, everything would be fine. But you had to connect it all, didn't you? You had to turn it all into one big world-changing miracle machine so people could see that you were right all along. Because you're a megalomaniac. I was trying to show them a different way. To give them tools that could change how we live. And that's why you have to burn. As she did. Whoa. Oh my. Oh my goodness. Whoa. Okay. That one escalated in a way I did not expect it to. Wow. God, what a horrific mind to be stuck in what a horrific cruel mindset to be plaguing yourself with to just torture yourself with those kind of thoughts over and over which clearly are not true but they're manifesting in such a true way that it's probably hard to recognize that oh more answers we need more answers narrow path okay yes oh wait this oh okay okay i can i can get i can get rgb converters okay oh my goodness whoa okay i'm i'm excited for this <laughs> this is gonna be good i think I need the red and the blue to get the green connection. Hmm. Hold on, bring you back in here. Bring you back in here. I'm gonna make a green. And I'm using blue and green to make red. Also, oh my goodness, Suzume! Hello, welcome on in. Gay Wolf Raid. Welcome, welcome, Raiders. How's it? Oh, oh boy, you're playing Highway Blossoms. Oh, yes. Yes, I approve. Happy Sapphic Sunday. <laughs> welcome on in. Welcome to Puzzle Time. I have had a few small brain moments, but it's okay. I've redeemed myself. I've, I've redeemed my, my puzzle um, rep reputation, I guess. I guess reputation. And thank you for the hydrate and posture check too. <laughs> Have a sip of my drink and a big stretch. Oh, wait. You're in pain. You're playing next exit. Oh my goodness. That that DLC is so, so emotional. It's such a, it is such a ride. It's like, strap yourself in. You're, you are on, you are on your way to a journey. <laughs> I can do that and use that to open the door. Then if I connect that to here, I can also connect that. Ha 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 ha. Puzzling, and I have another connector. So now. So now, what the heck? Right, well now I don't need Hmm. I don't need the green to be connected there anymore. But uh, okay, I played it. Yes, I, I played it as soon as it came out. <laughs> I didn't stream it. It was, I think, wait, wait, when did it come out? Did it come out before I 
started streaming. I genuinely don't remember how long it's been now. I think it may have come out like just before I started streaming. Yes, it was just before I started streaming. So that's the reason why I never streamed it. Yeah, because I, I started streaming January 2021. <laughs> but yeah, I played it as soon as it came out and I I really love the DLC. I think I a little part of me likes it a little bit more than the base game. It's really good. But I hope you've been having fun with it. I hope you had a great stream. Also, Noi, hello. Welcome, welcome. Thank you for the 41 months. Oh my goodness. <laughs> can't believe how long it's been. We're talking about when things came out and times and stuff. And I'm just like, this This doesn't feel real. What's going on? What is time? Time is fake. <laughs> right. Right, I'm doing the green so that I can see it from here. I'm gonna do the green and blue to make red off to the side. And now I need to figure out how to get to blue. I can't reach the blue from here. But I think I could reach red and green. Yes, so I, I use the this one. So I connect this here and I also attach the red and the green to it. Like that, yes. And now this opens and I've got, oh, it's a storable one. Oh, it's a storable one, oh yes. Oh, so much pain. You only just got to the convention with the bakers. <laughs> oh, the the moment, the, the, the convention sales, ah. Uh -huh. But how's Talos DLC been? Oh, this, this game is so good. I love this game. I love this game so much. I am, Okay, I need to figure out how I can do this. I am having so much fun with it. Oh, I know what I do with this. I can use this to get a red that is right next to here so I'm not trailing lasers across the place. So then I can break all of these and I've got these free to use because I've just got this little portable red. <laughs> so, and I can get all the other colors. But uh, the DLC has been so much fun though, because I'm I'm currently on the third Talos DLC. Like the DLC pack came with three different, like, well, packs. I, it was like the DLC set with three different like sections in it. And each one has had like a different feel and a different vibe to the puzzles and stuff. I'm currently on the third one and the puzzles are incredibly difficult. And I love it. I love it a lot. I I live for it. <laughs> it's my favorite. Right, I don't know if there's a way I can make that reach. No, I don't think so. But I, I have this free now as well. The question is, I don't know if I need these to be RGB ones or just regular connectors. So I'm I'm gonna start just like like this and then in here yeah I need two in here so then it's not optimal that this is connected like this hmm how do I do this because I put this here so I'd be able to reach the red I don't know if I really need to? No, I think I am going to need to. Right, so from here I can see red and blue. So I can do that. And then with the red and the blue I can make the green. But I need the red as well. I need another connector for that. I feel like having this here is not where it should be. Maybe. So where's the red laser? The red laser's all the way over here. Hmm. 
Hmm. Ideally, I need to just connect the blue with a single one of these. If I had one of the the red blue converters, it would be so easy. But alas, I cannot. But yes, as well, uh, I forgot to mention too, I'm just like so engrossed in laces at the moment, I'm so sorry. <laughs> but if you're tired after your stream and you have to go rest or, or take an emotional break, <laughs> please don't feel like you have to stick around. There is never any obligation to be here and I very much appreciate the raid a lot. So if you have to go get some rest, get some food and drink, please feel free to do that. But also if you wanna stick around for a bit, enjoy some Talos times. <laughs> I'm having a lot of fun. I love this game. Right, that is like the, the closest angle I can get that at. But then if I do that, I can make a blue with one of these. Then it's just all the rest. How do I how do I get the green and red connected like this? Oh, it'd be nice to be able to just carry this over. I feel like this is the way to keep this door open. Oh, unless I use the blue. <gasps> no, wait, yes, I get it. I know what I gotta do now. I I know what I'm doing. Maybe. Single connector. Connecting it with the red, so it's going to cross right over here. Then we're going to make this blue. I'm just going to place this for a moment so I can remove this. Right, so now we, we can see the red. I've got a little portable blue one here that we can use to immediately connect with these two. And that means I'm free with this. So then go red and blue, make green. Oh no, I don't connect that one yet. Like that. Red and blue make green. And then, I thought I had one more thing. Maybe I don't, uh, hold on. Yeah, I do, no I do, yes. So then with this, I just connect to the red, red and red. Right, so then the last thing here is just the blue. So, hmm. How can I connect that blue as well? I'm almost here. I've almost made it. This is... I just need to connect that blue. Right, is there a way I can set this up with like a switching sequence to block the connections I think there's gonna be a way I can do this where I can alternate it slightly where I can set it up so that it's like one of them will be active and then it will block the other one and then it'll block the other one again and so it'll like take it in turns for them to be active but it's been a while since I did that and I've forgotten how I did it before so if I do that no, that just like breaks the beam. Mm. It's the fact that these blues are on the outside and the green goes across it. Ha! Oh, you're mostly not paying attention, but then you hear me go, oh, I know what I'm doing, and you get excited. <laughs> I'm so glad! I'm so glad. I am I get excited for myself, too. <laughs> but it's also so funny when I end up going to an area and I'm like, I know what I'm doing. I've got this. I've solved it. And then I haven't. <laughs> See, this would be a really nice time to have a cube or something like that. Also, Resta, hello. Welcome, welcome. How's it going? Nice to see you. Happy Sunday. Welcome to... I am... 
trying to figure out how to do this. There's got to be a way I can do this where they, they take it in turns to block. Block each other off. Oh, hold on. I think do I connect it to this one? And then also connect this to this one. No. And I connect this to this and this. Oh, wait, wait, never mind. Hmm. No, oh, yeah, that's going to break that beam. I know there's a way I've already done something similar to this. I found something similar to make it work in this kind of way. And I can't remember what I did. Because <laughs> if, if I can make them alternate, it would be perfect. off the one I need first, which is the one that connects to this. Here, and then move this over with that. I, I can do that. Oh, how can I get the blue through from here, though? bring the red any closer with what I've got. Also good good, today's been a cozy Sunday. I'm happy to hear it. I've had a really cozy Sunday as well, actually. Um, I didn't sleep very well last night, but then I, I slept in until early afternoon today. So I've, <laughs> I've spent the day sleeping and I needed the sleep. So it was very nice. And then we had, we had a full roast dinner, our, our Sunday dinner, Sunday roast, which was extremely nice. And now I'm playing Talos, and I love this game. Right. Yeah, no, all I'm doing is blocking things like this. Because it's like, I can do that, I do this. Connect, connect, connect. That opens these two. It's like, if only there was a way. Hold on, I may have an idea actually. Maybe. I instinctively went for the blue with this. What if I grab myself a green? What if instead of having that blue, I have it green? So now this is green. I've got the green one here, which I can place out of the way when I have everything set up. I can take this one back and connect this to red and green and make it blue. 
red plus green make blue. Yeah, this is it, this is it. Okay, that's what I had to do. Yes! Green, red, blue, blue. Yeah, there we go, I did it. Okay, that's what I needed to do. <laughs> Yay! I immediately went to the blue and then I was like, well, hold on, the green is what's causing the problems here. I can, I can just grab the green. These puzzles green. are not easy. No, they're not. There is a part of Athena that wants to stay, 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 stay trapped. Mm. It hides away that which it cannot bear. Not only despair, despair. but also hope. So she still has hope. Yes. Somewhere there is a flicker of it that will not die. And I'm gonna find I sense it. it. But I cannot see it. I'll find it. I will find it. I will find that hope. That was a really cool one though. These I love these laser puzzles. This is great. But a thank you for the confetti too. Also the comment as well, like the vine clipping through the red makes it look like it's never fully connected. <laughs> yeah, I, I I noticed as it was as I was placing it and I was like, well, I feel like if I try and place it again I will mess it up. So I shall simply leave it. Oh, I really like that one though. That was fun. Right, so I I guess 16 next. Just gonna have a look, little look around the side first. But yeah, I I think like especially with all of the conflicting emotions that Athena's going through right now, it it's probably like the part of her that doesn't want to be freed is probably because of like her guilt like she she wants to punish herself she's like well this is my fault i shouldn't be freed i should be punished i should be jailed like this is like her prison which is like i understand it but also no no i'm i'm breaking you out <laughs> okay i didn't see anything along the way Fragile balance, my favorite. Okay, what's gonna be balancing here? I'm... Okay. Oh. Oh, okay. Sticking these in the middle, I see. Just gonna go through very straightforward, wait until the moment when it goes, hey, yeah, just kidding, you can't do it. Okay, yep. I see. I see. Okay. All right. Uh <laughs> oh my goodness, how, oh, wow. I think I have an idea of what's going to have to be done here. Yeah, I think if I do that and that, have these all low down. Then these open without this. Now this is free. So now I'm thinking if I use this and get all of the red ones. I hope I don't break everything. I didn't want to connect it to that one. Red, 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 connected to that blue. Oh. Oh, it's breaking them again. The blue needs to be lower down to do this. that okay and then I just need to do the first three will this work will this work <laughs> a big stool it would be interesting to sit on a stool this big it's like the same height as me <laughs> It's more of a table, it's like a tall table. Right, oh, but because that's closed, uh. Okay, 
actually. What happens if I do that? It breaks, okay. If I do that. And then that, okay. No, never mind. Let me keep this open a bit more. I need to connect this to all four of them. This one needs to be connected to all of the reds. Like that. And now, I'll bring this to do the blue. Like that, and then that'll open that. And then these ones can connect. the original blue though and they're in the way all in the way if I take this away is it gonna happen fast enough no it blocks it all okay okay reset <laughs> I see the idea here I see what I have to do here but it is a very fragile balance it's very true. We'll start by doing that. I'll bring the blue, open the blue here. Okay, all of that is open, so now this one can just be taken to the end. And then now this is where the fragile part starts. Oh, I'm actually thinking, I don't want this in the middle. I think I do this, actually. No, not that one. Ah, oh, I keep clicking on the wrong ones. That and that and red. Please. Yes. Oh, I broke those. I can fix that. Can I fix that? Yeah, I need this to be lower. want to be high, I guess. Oh, I think I broke it again. Yep, never mind. Ah, <laughs> oh, this is a this is a tricky one because this is like getting it wrong. I just trap myself. <laughs> oh, thank you for the hydrate too. <laughs> yes, let me have some more brain cells. Another sip of my monster and another big stretch. Ugh, thank you very much. <laughs> right. Start. Open it up. Yep. That's open. It's the way to order things without making a mess of it, which is the tricky part. Right, I think I have this up high. Like this. And then what I actually want to do is have this lower down, but connected to all of these. Oh no, but I also want this connected to the... I want this connected to the first laser. this because then if I do that yeah look at that look at that look at that that's connected to all four of those now oh, if I'd done it a little further back that would be really nice 
but alas, I did not. And I think that is my problem. I should have waited to connect all of these. But if I can now connect the blue up here... No, not with that. Oh, I keep... I keep clicking on the, the, the connectors that I don't want. Oh, like that. I do that, and that, and the red laser, and then place it. Thank you. So then that means I can take away this one. Boom. Now I've got two of them. If only I'd connected this a little further back, it would be perfect. <laughs> but alas, I did not. Because I am a fool. <laughs> Press X to pay respects. Yeah, another one of those planning ahead puzzles. Oh, this one is honestly okay. Because this is like... Not as as long. Like, this is still like a very contained... Area, if that makes sense. But, uh, yeah, I think... I have managed to slightly fluff this one up. See if I can bring it back. I think this is going to interact with the blues if I do this. Yeah, that blocked the blues off. Okay. I reset. I reset. I think I know what I'm doing. I just need to, to do it the other way. I need to make sure I don't set that up until I'm in the last area. Oh, uh, wait. Uh, you can deselect individual things. Wait, you can? How? Oh, you right. Oh my goodness. You right click when. Oh my. <laughs> I didn't actually know that. I didn't actually know that. I, I knew about like hold down right click to just deselect everything, but I, d I didn't realize. Oh, that. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. I am a little silly. I'm a little bit silly. Just a little tiny bit. So now I do that, that, and that. Put it up here. That's connected through to the end. I set this up outside of the gate this time. But I do that, and I do the one, two, three, four. Make sure it's in line. Like that, yep. Fabulous. So now I can do that. Yeah, there we go. I've got it now. <laughs> I've got it now. Because now I can do the blues like that. Put it on there. I can just take this blue away. I got it. There we go. And they're all here. There. <laughs> I knew I could do it. <laughs> I did it! I love how I was like, I literally had the solution. I just built the, built the solution in the wrong place. <laughs> Woohoo! <sighs> Fun fact, this would not work in Talos 1. Oh, why? Why wouldn't it? Is it have, the, have the laser rules changed? did it. Yay. Ah. Silly, you thinking I'd need to charge all the receivers while they're on each of the buttons. No, like once they're through that last gate, I, d I don't care if the gate's shut behind me. I've, I've got them. <laughs> oh, and tell us one, there's no immediate propagation like here. I see. Oh yeah, like the, the little gap between when it breaks and reconnects. I'm glad they kept it so it's like a seamless connection. Because it feels like the way it, it should work. Like if everything is connected, like taking away one. Uh, right, where am I? I? I immediately just lost the thought I had just now. I, I think you can tell it's getting late. But uh, before I head off though, I do want to step back into one of the other puzzles again. Go have a look. 
one of the ones that I walked away from. So, 10 or 11. I'm, I'm gonna go 10. I'm going 10. <laughs> I'm gonna go 10! Let's give this a try again. Deja vu. So what was this called again? A metathesis. What does that mean? Well, I... I can make an educated guess, but... Uh, another term for double decomposition. Uh, a reaction in which two compounds exchange ions. Okay. Okay, that's interesting to know. That feels like it would be relevant. Okay. I think I have an idea on what I want to try with this one. I think the idea is going to be like connecting things in a way where I can change which color it's connected to. So like to begin with, it'll be one color, but then it will change to a second one. After everything's set up. I think that's the way it, I, I, I'll need to do this. Yeah, cause I need, I need another connector over here. So I need to figure out how I can get one of these in here. Ah, uh, I'm surprised it wasn't in one. Figuring it out on Puzzle 16 felt like you were remembering it somehow. <laughs> yeah, it is It is interesting. I, I feel like the, the puzzles in this area, they're not necessarily, like, as much in order as some of the other ones have been. At least it hasn't really, like, felt like that. But yeah, I think what I'm going to have to do here is going to be... If I can manage to figure out a way where it will change what it's connected to. Hmm. Oh, I mean, in Talos one. Yeah, like... I don't know. Yeah, I, I didn't even think about the fact that it wasn't like a mechanic from Talos one. Like, it felt so intrinsically, like, correct. But that's actually really interesting to know that it wouldn't have worked in one, because I, I wouldn't have thought about it that way, if that makes sense. I'm probably going to make a little less sense now that it's nearly 1am, but, but yeah, it's the kind of thing where it's like... Very interesting in that way. Right, I'm wondering here... Kiroboros, hello! Thank you for the head pad posture check. Hydrate. Let me have a big stretch. I'm getting all the big stretches at the end of the stream. It's perfect. And a sip of my drink. Hello! Welcome to laser time. I don't know what's happening, and I love it. I really want to solve this one. I really want to solve it. The fact that it's so similar to the other one, whilst still... whilst being completely different is really, really interesting. Right, I wonder if there's a way I can... Hmm. See, I'm not sure how to get... How to make this work. Unless I do like this? I made that, no, I made that blue. Why would I, why would I make it blue? Oh yeah, if I, 
Now I'm gonna start with that. I'm gonna make this blue. I don't know why it's blue. I will figure out why I'm making it blue in a second. But uh, if I can, yeah, remove this. Blue plus green makes the red for here. I do this and also I stand in the way of this for a second. Okay, that's connected to just the red at the moment. But no, it does need this green if I do this. Open that up again. Okay, I've ma I've made whatever this is. <laughs> so like from here. Oh, it's like if I can make the green out here, it would be so much easier make the green out here but I don't think there's a way I can make the green here without breaking everything else in the process yeah I broke all of that then it's this one this one is breaking everything if I do that, oh no, it, it's the blue as well. Never mind, they're both breaking everything. <laughs> oh, you were lurking the whole time. Thank you. I'm glad you were here, but oh, I hope you have a good rest too. And Karazu as well. Hello. Welcome, welcome, welcome to me towards the end of the stream, trying to figure out what the heck I am doing. It's an adventure. I need, I can't body block both of these is the problem. Alright, so I'm just gonna like pick all of these up again. Right, I've, I've got that connected to both of these. It's probably not ideal. It makes things a little bit awkward for actually making anything work. However... made this green. This green and red makes blue. But it's being blocked by that laser. But what if I connect it to that as well? The other side. It's not blocking it quickly enough. Oh, it might do if I do this. Do that, yeah. Okay. No, not quite. No, it's still getting broken by that. It's lighting up for a little bit and then breaking again. Right, because I've got an idea here now as well. I'm thinking if I do the same thing I did before, like the fact that there's one up here and one up here, I think I can use these to do the same kind of clockwork laser mechanism to like block them off after a while, to like connect it all and then make it stop and then bring it back the other way. I just need to figure out how exactly I want this to work. <laughs> I need it to block these ones. So ideally I connect both of these and then like I block this. With that beam, but then I can use this. So then go blue and green, make red. Like that. And then the same on the other side, the green and red make blue. So I also connect it to here. I do something like this. Right. OK, 
Okay, that's set up in a way where the laser is being blocked by this green in the middle now. When I do that. So if I can now connect this to these... Ah, I broke it again. Okay. It's fine. Yes, okay, that, that works. This works. If I take away this green now... There! I did it! I did it! I did it! Yes! It worked how I, how I thought it would! I'm so proud! I'm so proud! It actually worked! It actually blocked them the right way! Oh, I didn't think that was gonna work for a second. I feel powerful. Yes! I'm so glad I remembered that. <laughs> oh, that was a really tricky one. That one was really hard. But I feel so accomplished Tell me, with all this. Yoshin, was Athena happy here oh. on the island before everything went wrong? She was. I'm glad she finds some measure of happiness out here, but... I wish she could have been happier with us in the city. Mm. Is that selfish of me? Perhaps. I think it's human. But her happiness was never complete. She always knew that we are not born for ourselves alone, and she could not abandon her responsibilities forever. That solution was too big brain for you. You have no regrets about choosing it. <laughs> oh, I, how did you manage to cheese it then? I love that thought. But yeah, I, it was trying, I was trying to remember the order I connected things in before to make like those breaking, reconnecting, like that kind of loop. And I'm glad I did figure it out in the end, but it did take a lot of trying. Anyway, with that, it is 1am now, so I should probably leave it at that for now. But I think I've done pretty well to save. Saving at the ring. But I think I've done pretty well. I came in here completing five? Yeah, I've done five when I got in here. And now I've done six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. So that's ten puzzles. So if, if I'm working on that, I'm basically working at a rate of uh, five puzzles every two hours, I guess. <laughs> so that doesn't feel too bad considering how difficult these are. But I feel extremely accomplished right now. I am just about two thirds of the way through the puzzles. Although I have no idea how hard these are gonna be and how hard, how long it's gonna take me to figure out this ring one. <laughs> Ah, uh, the cheese for that level is dangerous knowledge. Once I know about it, it's very tempting to use it elsewhere. Maybe I will not ask then. Because <laughs> wherever possible, I always like to try and figure out a solution that doesn't feel like cheating. Like, sometimes I've gotten solutions where I don't think it was the intended solution, but it still felt smart enough that I'm like, you know what, I'm happy with this. I'm proud of myself for this. <laughs> but then other times it's like, I'll do something, and then I'll go back and be like, no, I didn't solve that properly. I need to figure that out. Like the one puzzle in base Talos, like I passed myself an item through a window to solve the puzzle. And it was very much not intended. I don't think I should have been able to do that. And it kind of like cheated the whole puzzle. <laughs> it cut out the whole puzzle by me just passing a connector thing through. So like things like that, when that happens, I will go back and solve it properly. But it is funny managing to to break it from time to time. Anyway, I've I'm gonna I've saved the game. Right at the ring, so that's a really fun spot for me to start next week at. <laughs> but maybe my brain will be able to figure it out. Like if I ruminate on it over the week, like if I keep thinking about it, I may be able to figure it out. But yeah, I think for now. It is- oh my goodness, no! No! No, I'm so sorry! Swamp Raid, hello! I'm just about to end. <laughs> I'm so sorry, I'm just about to end the stream. <laughs> you caught me right as I'm finishing. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, I hope you don't mind if the raid train keeps going along to another stop. <laughs> 
Oh, thank you so much for the raid, though. Hold on, let me... I'll bloop over here. I can say hi to you over here, at least. But, uh, hello! Hi, raiders! Welcome! And goodbye. I'm so sorry. <laughs> it's, uh, it's actually 1am for me right now, so I... Usually, like, if I get a raid towards the end of a stream, I'll try and keep going a, a little bit longer, but with it being so late, I can't really do that. But thank you for bringing the raid this way either way. I do appreciate it. I'm so sorry. <laughs> sweet note sent you. Oh, sweet note. Thank you. I'm very appreciated too. I thought you might have when I saw your name pop up with the raid message. But I hope you had fun with the Team Fortress too. I hope you had a good stream. To anyone who's new here, hello. I'm Liri. I'm a pink-haired cat girl from the UK and I love comfy games and puzzle games. And I've just been playing a puzzle game. I've just been big braining in the Talos Principle 2 DLC. And the puzzles have been very difficult and I love it. I'm living for it. It's so good. Uh, it was awesome. Oh, playing Scout. Nice. I've never actually played TF2 myself. It's another one of those games where like, I know so much about it and I've watched so many other people play it, but I've never actually played it myself. There's a lot of games like that. <laughs> but I hope you had a good stream. Thank you for bringing it this way. I'm sorry it's such a, a short stop. <laughs> but I'll be sending the raid train on somewhere else. We'll, we'll keep it going. Keep the raid hype going. Let's, let's see who's around to raid. But yeah, thank you for bringing it this way. I'm so sorry. It's If it wasn't 1am, I'd keep going a bit longer, but I, I'm asleep. I'm very tired. <laughs> I used to pull the brain cells and now I'm EP. Yeah, let's see who is around. Who haven't I raided in a while? There's a few people online. Hmm. Oh, see, this is the problem when I have to make decisions and there's too many people on. Ah, <laughs> oh, great one, free two. Ain't got an ounce of brain cell left. Me neither. I used all of mine, like all three of them. <laughs> Bouncing around in my brain until they hit the corner like a like a DVD screensaver. Yeah, they're gone now. They poofed. I used them though. But yeah, thank you for bringing the raid this way. I'm so sorry. It's such a short raid stop. But uh, let's find someone else. Uh, I'm wondering. Oh, I think. I think I'm going to send the raid over to Neurosis VT. Neur is really cool. And also playing Dragon Age Origins at the moment, which that's another game that I, I keep meaning to play myself. And I've never gotten around to it, even though it's the kind of game that I know I would love. Like, I, I know, hands down, I would love Dragon Age. <laughs> I just haven't gotten around to it. But yeah, I'm gonna send you over to the lovely Neurosis and see how how she's doing with her Dragon Age shenanigans. <laughs> but oh, stay for the raid. Oh, thank you. Yeah, let's see where the next stop heads off to. Here is the raid message. If you're subbed, we have the Lyri fire. If you're not subbed, we have normal fire. The fire is because we are stuck in the abyss listening to Athena's intrusive thoughts. <laughs> but I'm going to send you over to Nur. Please send the love from me. She's very cool. And because of time zones, I don't get to raid her very often, so I'm going to take advantage of it. <laughs> but yeah, it's been a really nice stream, though. I really appreciate everyone joining me, stopping by, even though th there have been so many times today where I was just... I don't know what was going on. I don't know where my brain was going. I was... <laughs> I was just sat staring at the, the ring puzzle. I was just like, I don't know what I'm doing here. So I'm hoping that having the week to think about it and think it through in my head, I can kind of memorize where the pieces are in my head. I'm going to make a little diagram and try and figure that out for next week. But if I can't, it's, it's fine. There's still another eight. <laughs> but yes, puzzles. I love them. I love them so much. I love lasers. The lasers are just my favorite. I just really like the laser puzzles. Yeah, let's get this raid kicked off, though. And I will go and lie down. Because I am... I didn't realize how tired I was until I, I went onto this screen to start the, the ending stuff. I'm, I'm, I'm really tired. 
I gotta go sleep. I hope I do sleep. Maybe I'll end up making more sleep-deprived notes, like my my planned solution for Puzzle 6 this week. But uh, thank you so much. Thank you for being here. Thank you for raiding. Thank you, any raiders, for sticking around. It is always appreciated. Uh, my schedule for next week will be late, but um, I'll give you a little spoiler. It's probably going to be the exact same schedule as this week. <laughs> Like, even down to the times, too. I'm going to do a late Tuesday stream, and then Friday, Sunday. I, I think that's going to be the whole schedule. I don't think there's going to be any extra stuff. I need to take a little bit of time for myself, for both personal reasons and because I've got cool stuff I'm cooking up. <laughs> but yes, I go sleep now. Thank you so much, everyone, for joining me today. And until next time, bye-bye.